cardio burns fat, right? No, cardio actually burns calories. turn the music back how's it going it's so good to see you i hope everyone's having a good weekend oh man oh wait no i just made okay okay all right we're good we're good hi takanjia hi dave hi emma hi make rob hi jost oh my gosh hello spectral melodies hello oh my gosh you like that thank you i appreciate that hi is it Aquitas? 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 Hello, welcome in. I'm sorry if I pronounce your name wrong. Hi, Lord Ars. Hello, welcome in. So I'm gonna, I know I usually don't broadcast on Saturdays, but I was like, oh man, I really wanna test out my OSSC and see how it works with like the Amiga and the Super Nintendo and stuff like that. So we have our OSSC here. That intro was epic. Thank you. I can smell the theater popcorn. Oh man, I know, right? Good times. Those are super good times. Yes. Get an OSSC, they're brilliant. Oh my gosh, this is like, it is seriously one of the best things I've ever gotten. I played around with it for a little while, but I didn't get to test it with the Amiga yet. So here we are, here we are. And I've got like a stack of um, diskettes to try out. That is Music Man, yes it is, it is. He put me onto his music and I was like, oh my God, this is so great. I'm gonna definitely use this, especially for like a time like now where we're just gonna kind of like chill and stuff. So yes, hi Anus Tart. One of my favorite memories of seeing the he brought you here. He did. Oh my gosh, yes. I'm so happy that I popped into his channel the other day. He's so sweet, and it was such a great like chill vibe in there, and I was so happy. Hi Rihanna. Hello. Welcome in. One of my favorite memories was seeing the first Ninja Turtles movie on opening night with my giant gummy rat. Oh my gosh. Yo, thank you so much. So usually we do play a lot of like Nintendo. We do play a lot of retro for you all that this is like your first time here. And what we're going to be doing today is I have this. This is the OSSC. So this is basically an upscaler with like close to zero latency, if not zero latency. And it's really supposed to be one of the best on the market so um we're gonna play around with this today we're also gonna hook it hook my super nintendo up to it zero lag hi lvc oh my gosh yes gdq yesterday <laughs> you nerd yo latency latency is basically like delay spectral melodies is like delay Sitting on the sixth segment of S S SBB, yo, welcome in, yo. Pogo, thank you so much. It is Infinity. I was using Infinity album on my stream today. Oh, nice. Technically a line doubler, but basically an upscaler. There you go. See, I'm. Uh, you all have to teach me because I don't know all the technical stuff. So thank you for teaching me. Rocky and Bullwinkle. Oh, man. Hi, Mikey Bell. Yeah, Rocky and Bullwinkle. That game could go and kick rocks. Seriously. Oh, my God. But yes, if you didn't um see yesterday, I was on the GDQ channel, the Games Done Quick channel. And I was playing with Pleasantly Twisted on a game called Super Boss Bros, although that episode was Super Bo Boss Sisters. And um, Bobby Blacktastic and Big John hosted, and it was so awesome. Hi, Manny. Hello. How are you? This Magic Cube has more magic than other ones. Exactly. It's been a while since I played retro games. What's my fave? Link to the past. Hi, Dr. O. Did I hear Rocky and Bullwinkle? Oh my gosh, Dr. O. I was playing Rocky and Bullwinkle on the GDQ channel yesterday and Mega Man, I think like the Wily something, it was a Game Boy game. And oh man, those games, they, they really were so tough. 
That's oh yeah, so that's what we were talking about. Basically, it converts the signal. I got some GDQ shirts last week. That's awesome. I just so memorized all the Nintendo stuff. Well, thank you. We have lots of stuff here. Dr. Wiley's Revenge. There you go. Use the OSSC for everything. Yeah, it's great. So I have um I have um a SCART cable that I will connect and use with my Super Nintendo and also a SCART cable that I will use for my Amiga right here. Some type of electricity, exactly. X-Men the Animated Series, nice. But yeah, that's what we did yesterday. Super Boss Bros was such a fun experience and I'm so glad that I got to be a part of that and it was really, really, really fun. So. Thank you so much for cheering me on yesterday. That was really great. That was really great. Hi, Polly. Hello. So, okay. So here's what we have today. So, um, I also have, just in case these things don't work out, I have like a SCART HDMI and all my wires are also in here. All my other wires are also in here. So we're gonna, we're gonna test those things out. And I'm super excited. And let me show you all. So we've got a stack. We've got a stack of diskettes here that we're going to test out as well. I'm super excited. Thank you so much for the host. Pancake. Vital Pancake. Thank you so much. So, um, here we go. Here's my case of diskettes that we're also going to look through. I don't know what's gonna work and what's not gonna work. Honestly, y'all, because I don't know if any of these have suffered any disc rot. I don't know. So we're gonna be finding all this stuff out together. I have tons, there's tons of games in here. Tons and tons of games in here. Tons of sample discs. And like I said, I don't know what's gonna work. Um, but So we're gonna be testing all this as much as we can out. Oh, we got Arkanoid in here. We got Arkanoid. So these are all my dad's games. These are all my dad's games and I inherited them and th okay, this one I'm going to keep out because I really want to check it out. Even though the disc doesn't look like it's in that great condition, we'll test it out. But this one's called Sorcerer Lord. Sorcerer Lord. I don't know what this is going to be about. So let's keep that one out to the side so we can know to test that one out okay here's some others there's some a little bit of weird stuff on this disc but um here we go okay this one is called demons winter i don't know what this is at all if anybody knows please chime in uh and something here called questron i don't know what this is either but we'll explore them together you know we'll explore it together it's gonna be super neat I don't know what, let's see what else is in here. Let's see. Um, Rubik, thank you so much for the host. Cap really don't get, didn't get it. Oh man. Oh, here we go. Here's another one called The Wrath of Nicodemus. I have no, okay. I have no clue what this is. I want it to be a sandbox game where it's just demon shoveling and side watching and some movies <laughs> and the same movies too many times. Yo, Grizzle, thank you so much. I appreciate that. I'm doing very well, Pancake. How are you today? I'm having a good day and I'm excited to share some Amiga goodies with you all. This is going to be super awesome. So here's, that's what's in this one. So I took those out to the side. Um, there's a lot in this one too. What is OSSC? Okay, I'll tell you. Rubik, an OSSC is basically an open source scan converter. And it basically, you can um, hook up your, you know, RGB systems and basically get no lag. So my Super Nintendo can be hooked up to this or any system that you mod to use RGB output. You're doing well? I'm glad to hear that you're doing well. Let's see. So we're going to look... I'm going to hook my Amiga up to it. We're going to see how it's going to look. And hopefully we'll get some games to work. 
Okay. And um for a whole week? What is this madness? Hi, Emil. How are you? Oh, here we also have some cool disc. A game called Sword of Sodan. Sword of Sodan. This looks interesting. Let's keep this one out to the side too and we can test it out. I don't know which game is which games are gonna work. Oh, this one is a three disc game. We're gonna have to be doing a lot of disc disc swapping with that one. I again I have no idea if all these games are gonna work. I hope lots of them work. I hope. How am I? I'm doing very well, thank you. I just wanted to have a relax chill broadcast and hang out with you all we'll probably play some super nintendo later as well or we could even do some animal crossing if anybody wants to help me in animal crossing that'll be super neato hi broom it's really an android oh man the secret is out hi mqg hello welcome in how are you today i hope you're doing well i'm doing so great how are you i'm having a good day oh man my cup my cup was stuck to my... This is my coaster that I have. It got stuck. That was my coaster. It got stuck. Hi, Tomo Tokyo. I am very well. How are you? How are you feeling today? I hope you're having a good weekend. The New York Mets. A A A A A A. Don't laugh at my Mets, all right? Don't laugh at my Mets. All right, let's open up the last one. Actually, I don't want to open it up. I know that there's a lot of games in here that I want to test out, period. Oh my god, these commercials are driving me nuts. Please stop with the ads. Okay, thank Hi. Oh my god. Dino, hello. Welcome in. Were those floppy disks? Thank you so much for the tier one sub. Yes, we're gonna be working with the Amiga today. Hi, Outlet. I'm a Mets fan. Nice. Yes. So, yes, we're gonna be working. Okay, so I have my OSSC, right? And we're gonna be working here. I'll show. I'll see if I could turn it around. You're allowed to laugh at the New York at the New York Jets, not the New York Mets. There you go. I'm gonna move my camera so you can see. So you all can see i have my amiga here it's my amiga 500 okay and we're gonna be we're gonna be testing out some discs hi afen hello welcome in sorry my camera's all jumbled around now okay there we go there we go so yes oh man look what did i do did i not put it close enough okay there we go let me move this a little bit. There we go. Okay, cool. Yes. Yeah, so yes. Yeah, so we already have some. I already have some discs here. I'm a Mets fan. And I don't think Hab is. Oh man. I don't know. I don't know if Hab is a Mets fan. I should ask him. So I can already confirm that these discs work. Second Saturday in a row that I've been live. Maybe. So here we have, I can confirm that this one works definitely, Chamber of the Psy Mutant Priestess. I can definitely confirm that these, this one works and Shadow of the Beast too. I can confirm that these work because I tested them and they definitely did work. You've never seen an Amiga before you found our stream? Yes, it was more popular in Europe. You don't typically see a lot in America, unfortunately. Scarab, thank you so much for the tier one sub for two months. Floppies, yes, hi, my wife is hot. My son wanted me to tell you, I love her stream, she's like Nintendo. Oh, Grizz, that means the world to me. Thank you so much, and I'm so, so glad that you can share it as a family. Thank you so much. Yo, Floppy Disc Live, hi, Hijab Homegirl. Hello, hi, Kaiser J. I always wanted an Amiga, but we couldn't afford one. Had a Commodore 64. I have a Commodore somewhere, and I also have an Atari over here. And I have to find the wires for it. Find the wires for it. This is the Atari that I have. It's a 130XE. 
I have to find the wires. Oh, SSC, hi, Pi Mantle. How are you? Welcome in. I was aware of old Windows 98 computers, floppy disk, and CD ROM. Games that went into the computer to play, but never an Amiga. Hi, Tuds. Hello, it's good to see you. You're doing well? I am doing very well, thank you. I'm doing very well. That wants to start cursing now that they know a kid is watching. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. And may I suggest turning that Atari into a MIDI controller? Hi, Pern. I'm well. How are you today? You like my DK shirt? Thank you very much. This is one of my favorite shirts, actually, because it's really super comfy. It's super comfy. In the 80s, the European played games on their computers. We in America played games on systems like the NES. Hammerman, thank you so much for the host. Hi, Pfizer. Hello, welcome in. You like the Kirby? Oh, yes, my Kirby blanket. This is one of my favorite blankets. I love this blanket so much. It's really soft and cozy. Hammermind, people of the chat, I'm good. You like my shirt? My friend had an Amiga with Desert Strike, Super Frog, and some football soccer game. Well, I'm super excited to be able to share this moment with you all <laughs> and um, turn this stuff on. Oh, we got a Dungeon Master disc here, which I definitely want to test that out for sure. I definitely want to test that that out. We got Gauntlet. Oh, we got Defender of the Crown. Okay, I'm gonna have to test out these Defender of the Crown discs. Cozy chat, cozy shirt, cozy blanket. You got the hat trick. Oh my gosh, yes. I'm doing great, Hammerman. How was your weekend going? We also here, we also have Dragon's Layer 2. We should test this out as well and see if it works. It was good. I'm so glad to hear that. I'm so glad. Oh my gosh, y'all. Let me tell you. Dragon's Lair has six discs. Six discs. We're gonna have to be doing a lot of disc swapping with this one. You haven't seen a computer disc since grade school? Oh, thank you, Mantle. You, oh my gosh. Desmond, how are you? It's good to see you. I can't believe Dungeon Dragon Slayer has six discs. That is nuts. That is nuts. Okay, here we go. Oh, here we go. Here's one that I definitely want to try. Obitus. I don't know if you've ever played Obitus, but I have this for Super Nintendo as well. So if this, if the Amiga version doesn't work, we can play the Super Nintendo version. I had kid loading games from floppies, let alone cassettes. You know, I do have Kaiser J. I have you and Squadron back there on a cassette. I have it right here. It's right here. Your last floppies were like junior high. Here's another one that I must test out. Here's another one. This is one of my favorite games of all time. Lemmings. You know how much I love Lemmings. I love this game so much. We're definitely gonna test that one out. So let's keep this one off to the side as well. Lemmings is fantastic. It's such a great game, right? Oh my God, Lemmings! Music Man, we're bumping your music! We're bumping your music, Music Man. It's so great! Everyone, if y'all don't know, hi, Nostalgia Nerd. Did someone say Lemmings? We sure did. You remember Lemmings? Oh man, here we go. Lemmings right here. Here we go. Thank you so much for the follow. Everyone, if you don't know Music Man 1017, you have to follow Music Man. Please follow his channel. Music Man, thank you so much for the tier one sub. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Here's another one. Oh, here's Barbarian. Remember we tried to play Barbarian on Ant Stream? I should see if this one works. But everyone, please make sure to follow Music Man. He is absolutely super amazing, incredible, talented musician. Plays music live on his broadcast. Loves, um... What, last time I was there, he was playing, um... Minecraft. It's such an awesome place to hang out. Time to stick around, but you got my attention, Lady Ash. Hi, Antonio Lords. Hello. 
Oh my gosh. Please, please, please. Make sure to check him out. So, so awesome. Thank you so much for the follow. Oh, here we go. We also have... Okay, I have to find this too. Okay, we have Obliterator here. We have Obliterator. We also have Leander. We have Leander. And I have to find this too. Of the... Oh, here we go. Here we go. The Killing Game Show. We have the Killing Game Show here. Oh my god. Obliterator. Yes. We have to try it. And I also have... Okay. Okay, we definitely do have two. Blood Money. We have Blood Money. So again, I don't know if these games are gonna work. We have to test them out. Oh! Overworld has two discs. So let's keep them together. Where is the Overlord disc? Alright, I'll have to find it. I'll put this to the side. Hi, Brother Bill! Hello! Welcome in! We're gonna test out the Amiga today with the OSSC! Thank you so much for that kind of beautiful words. Of course. My pleasure. My pleasure. Oh, here it is. Here it is. Here's Overlord. So here we get, we, we're gonna test these games out. And I'm super excited to share this with you all. Let's see what works. Let's see what doesn't work. I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know what's gonna happen, everybody. So let's hope for the best here. I don't know. Most of them could work. None of them could work. I don't know what's gonna happen. You didn't see any notification? Don't worry. Don't worry. That's totally fine. Okay. Thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Okay, so here's what we have to do. We are going to plug in the OSSC, which is what I'm doing right now. Wrestling with your watercolors? No problem, hijab homegirl. You literally just got one? Oh my gosh. What has been your experience with it? Here it is, Nostalgia Nerd. Here's my OSSC. So far, I tested out a Super Nintendo. I tested out my Super Nintendo with it, and it worked beautifully. It worked beautifully. So I was extremely happy, extremely happy with that. I have not tried my Amiga with it. So that's what we're gonna do today. I was gonna use it for streaming. You should. I okay. So after this, after we test, we play around with the Amiga. We'll play around with the Super Nintendo. How's that sound? We could do some UN Squadron runs. Because I know the Amiga, I know that the Super Nintendo works with this for sure. Because I definitely did test that out. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna, we're gonna, I'm, okay, Brother Bill, if you're here, I might need your help to figure out where this plugs into. DJ Black Tino, it's a, it's basically, um, it's called Open Source Scan Converter. So you can plug in RGB consoles and it'll make them look very beautiful. It's called, as as Anus Tart told me, it's a line doubler. So it'll basically play your games with almost no lag. And it's great. And the quality is good. The quality is beautiful. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. I wish I can hook the camera up. You don't want to be rude, but why does my profile picture have that mood face? Uh, like, a mood? Like what? What do you mean? Into the red and white jacks on the back of the Amiga. Okay, got it. Um, I mean, that's the photo that they used for the Black History Month campaign that I am currently in. So I wanted it to be consistent with my branding. Looks like a thoughtful profile picture. I don't know. I thought it was a nice one. I thought... I don't know, I just, I felt happy with that picture. All right, let's see, um... Okay, here we go. I'm like over here trying to figure out... Tuds, thank you so much. I'm here trying to figure out where the heck to plug this in. Okay, disk drive, serial port... Dorian? Dorian? Thank you so much for the raid! How was your broadcast? 
Dorian, you were playing Dragon Quest VIII? Oh my god, thank you so much for choosing our channel to raid. You know what's funny? Oh my gosh, wait, wait, wait. That is so awesome. Hi, Jamsters. Hi, Dragon Seal. Hi, Ro what? Oh my gosh, these ads, please stop. Okay. Um. Hi, Rob X Games. Hello. Hello. Hi, Axion. Hello. Welcome in. Oh my gosh, Dorian, thank you so much for choosing our channel. Hi, Glitch. Hello, welcome in, Raiders. Thank you so much for the host, Glitch. Yo, Dorian, how was your broadcast? How's Dragon Quest VIII? Okay, wait, hold on. Hold on, you're playing Dragon Quest VIII. I actually, I actually have Dragon Quest VIII in a pile of games right here. Here it is. Dragon Quest VIII. That is so cool. Welcome in. It's so great to have you. Welcome in, Raiders. I hope you had fun hanging out with Dorian. How was your broadcast? What did you all talk about today? Thank you so much for sharing your amazing community with me. I appreciate you so much. Everyone, please make sure to check out Dorian. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Dragon Quest Eight is my Saturday stream, but I do a lot of retro and variety through the week. And you stream everything from consoles and through upscalers. Oh my God. So yeah, so we just got... Okay, look. We just got an OSSC. I just got one. And we're going to test it out with my Amiga today. We're going to test it out with my Amiga. And play some Super Nintendo later as well. Thank you for sharing your amazing community with me. I very much appreciate you. How about a live stream play of it one day? Wait, a live stream play of what? How's Bobby? Hi, Scarab. Bobby is doing well. I don't know where she is. I think she's in the living room doing cat things. She's doing cat things. See if I can get one of those to hook up my Coleco vision. You should. Cat things are the best things. So I felt it fitting to stop. Oh, Dorian, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Yeah, so here. Here, um, I really need a second camera, everyone. I really need a second camera because this move in this camera is very difficult. But here we go. One step at a time, right? There's the Amiga. There's the Amiga right there. And I'm going to plug in this SCART, this, um, this cable into the Amiga and then have the SCART go into the OSSC. Hi, Tornado Jones. It lets you play old school consoles on... Yes, Ron God, exactly. Thank you so much, Team Kills. Thank you for cheering me on on GDQ yesterday. I had so much fun on the GDQ channel. I had so much fun on the GDQ channel, and it made me so happy to see so many familiar names in the chat. Even though I couldn't chat very much, I did see, I did see your names in there. Thank you for the follow. I did see your names in there, everyone. I really did, and it made me so happy. It made me so happy. There still might be some latency. I'm sure it wouldn't be so terrible, though. Oh, man. You, everyone, I just realized that I need a... Um, I might need a... might need a screwdriver. I might. That Rocky and Bullwinkle game was redonkulous. It, oh my gosh, Laser, you are telling the truth. You are telling the truth. Okay, hold on. How do I know which, okay, in this, Brother Bill, are you there? Or if any, anybody knows, you can just plug in the RGB. Okay, so the red and the black, which one goes into the right and which one goes into the left? For the red and the black and thank you so much dorian for sharing your community everyone please make sure to go check out dorian go give his channel a follow go give their channel a follow oh my gosh thank you so much rocky and bullwinkle game i'm optimistic but it was definitely janky the physics just didn't make any sense red is right it's red and black though does that matter red is right Red is right, white is left. I can't wait. Oh, let me turn the music back on. I just realized it was 
quiet. Sorry. The black is the same as white. Oh, got it. Okay. Okay. Oh. Sorry. YouTube was making an ad play. I had to turn the music off for a second. Okay, here we go. Am I a real or fake Pokemon fan? Mew versus Charizard, who wins? Well, I don't know. I don't I don't know how I should answer that question. I don't believe in fake fans. I believe that if you like something, you're a fan and you should be able to enjoy whatever you like. Yeah. Exactly what Mansell said. You're a fan, exactly. Play Pokemon my entire life and I don't even know the answer. That's because the answer is subjective. The answer is subjective, David Brownies. So it really doesn't matter the answer. It's a matter of taste. How did the Barbie game go? MQG, oh my God. It took me a while to figure out what the heck to even do. It was very, very interesting. Very interesting. Okay, I'm plugging the SCART into the OSSC right now. Okay, and now I'm gonna plug. And now I'm gonna plug the power into the Amiga. If you like something, you're a real person. You're a fan. There you go. Exactly. I found your channel through recommended from Bovine. I love Bovine. Bovine Divine is so knowledgeable. Bovine is so knowledgeable and awesome. Gamer J, hello. Yo, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. That really means a lot. That's really awesome. Okay, so I've got... Get the camera. I've got the SCART into the OSC. I haven't turned it on yet. And I've got the cable into the Amiga. Now I'm gonna plug... Well, I'm not gonna plug the power into the Amiga yet. That's gonna turn it on because I don't have a switch on this Amiga. And before I plug it in, I want to make sure that my capture card is plugged into the OSSC. It's totally subjective. BBP is such a cute. Cutie, the letters Q and T have been removed from keyboard to Hawaiian as a sign of respect, BBP. Hi, Purple Spectral, Spectrain. Bula, hello, thank you so much. Thank you for the GL. Thank you for the Arcus GL. Bovine, I chat all the time, he's awesome. He's been a huge help. Amiga origin originates. It's like, I think it's from the Spanish language. Like they did want to inspire that it would be like your friend, you know? Barring a standard trainer battle where things already depend on a lot of factors, me and Charizard will find a way to work together if they needed to. There you go. All I know is there's way too many of them. There are so many Pokemon. There are so many Pokemon. Okay, so I'm gonna take this HD... This HD cable. Hold on. Where do I have this plugged into? Okay. Figuring things out, people. Okay. Hi, Damien Blade. Hey. Ash, do you have a Sega Genesis? I, I don't, actually. I have a Sega Genesis Mini. I have a Sega Genesis Mini. I don't... Oh, my gosh. Damien, I hope you're having a great day. Okay, so we're going to take this HD cable out of my Switch. And we're going to plug this into the OSSC. That's what we're going to do right now. And then we're going to turn the OSSC on. It should be on. On. Oh my gosh, let me... I forgot to turn on the power strip. I forgot to turn on the power strip. I'm well, how are you? Shaolin Monk, I, we're gonna play a myriad of games today. We're gonna play a lot of games. 
We're testing out the Amiga currently as we speak. We're gonna turn, turn it on, turn it on. There we go. All right, let's see if the OSSC turned on. Oops, I know. Playing with power, hi Glarbuck. Hello, welcome in. How are you today? It's good to see you. I hope you're doing well. Thank you for coming by and saying hello. I really appreciate it. Okay, so here we go. Okay, the OSSC is on now. It's gonna be a little tricky because I got wires all over the place. So let's see. Let's see what happens when we plug in the power to the Amiga. So this is the OSSC screen right now. That's the OSSC screen. I'm just gonna pl put in the workbench disc for now. And then we'll put a game in after. We showed up yesterday, all my stuff stopped working. Oh man. Okay, and now we're gonna plug, now we're gonna plug the Amiga in. We're gonna see what's gonna happen. I don't know what's gonna happen. Oh. I hear a sound from the Amiga. I don't have any picture yet. I have to change the channel. All right, we're gonna do... That works. Looks like it's not. Okay. Fire Depot on speed dial just in case. Thank you for the follow. Hi, Wolfmaster. Hello, welcome in. Hey, we don't got anything there. You're into something new. Oh my god. Hi, Publish. Hello, like welcome really in. Good. How are you? you? Can help with that. Oh my god. Ads are killing. Okay to have. You have the fire depot. <laughs> okay, so the Amiga is on. Now I did, I did get this to work with um. All right, let's try. Huh. Okay. Let me think for a sec. I don't know if it's the wire or if it's my setting. I don't know which one it is. Wait. Try a different setting. There should be a button on the OSSC. I know, that is what I'm pressing. That is what I'm pressing. Because right now it's on AV1 RGB SCART. That is what it's on. But I don't know if I have to change. Yeah, I have it. It's on RGB SCART right now on AV1. Which is what's plugged in is the SCART cable. Did I break it? The Amiga does work. It does work. I just didn't um, use it with the OSSC. That isn't working yet. Change it to channel three, right? I know. It could be a setting within the OSSC itself. All right, how, let's, let's try something else. I have another idea here. I have another idea here, everyone. We're gonna try something else. And hopefully this should work. I'm gonna try something else. I had to use an extra cable for component on OSSC for PS2. Got you. 
All right, we're gonna try. We're gonna try this SCART to HDMI converter. We're gonna try this one instead and see what happens. You know, and see if this works. Hopefully, this works. All right, we're gonna plug in HDMI. I'm gonna plug in the SCART here. And then we're gonna plug this in and we're gonna see what happens. I feel like we're gonna get it to work tonight. We'll get it to work. Don't worry, everyone. Okay. I will. I'm determined. I'm very determined. I just gotta be careful because there's so many wires everywhere. All right, here we go. Wolf Master, you know what it is? There's probably some like, there's probably some like setting that I need to change that I don't know about. No? Yeah, my output. My output, not in Ash. Get it together. Come on. Yeah, it's more likely a setting on the OSS. All right. Thank you for the follow. Thank you so much. All right. The format is not supported. Get out of here, you. Hold on. Let's switch it. Sometimes when you switch it, that works. The format is not supported. Hold on. I'm waiting patiently and find it's interesting to listen to. Okay, we got lots of buttons to press here. Signal, format, not supported. All right, wait, 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 we got something. Something's happening. Something's happening here. We did it! We did it! Hi, Evil Moon. I find technical difficulty streams relaxing, so I'm happy either way. Very pog, everyone. Very pog. This is very pog. Let me tell you. All right. Let me ask you a question. Brother Bill, is this the whole screen? Is anything getting cut off, you think? Congrats, we did it. I'm still not used to using Pog. So excited to see what it has to offer. Oh man, you're in for a treat. For the next person to get right to, it seems like the right thing to do, just saying. A little bit. All right, let's see if we can remedy that. I don't think I can actually. Well, at least I don't know how to. All right, well, in any case, it's working. The mouse is working, look at this. The mouse is working. Well, I'm gonna skip this one. Oh my God, these ads. No, go away, ads. All right. So heckin' hype, thank you so much. I'm heckin' hype. All right, here we go. Look at this mouse. Okay, here we go. Sorry, it's good. Massive back in the day. Oh man. The three on one three is cut off, but that's actually normal. Okay. All right, so we have like, what seems to be like a zero latency here. Or should I help? I don't have the OSSC. I spent hours messing with the Frame Meister, getting the thing on the screen ratio to display correctly. I know it can be a pain, right? All right, so I'm gonna move the Amiga a little bit closer to us. All right, so, all right, so let's test out a game, right? Let's test out a game. I can't believe we got it to work. This is great. This is great. And it looks good too, right? What do y'all think? It looks good. Texas has been having Minnesota weather. It has no hard drive and one megabyte of RAM. There you go. Bravo. We got it to work. 
We got it to work, everyone. Okay. The only thing that's kind of funky is this mouse. Not gonna lie, it's a little funky. Yo, y'all hear this? It's real. Bravissimo! Look at this. Alright. Wow, I can drag this around. This is cool. The graphics in the left corner is amazing for the system. Yo, hello, Frenum. How are you? Alright, let's test out a game. Okay, how do I close this window? Do I press this? Little square in the corner here? That looks great. It does. Oh, yeah. Is this a OG Amiga on the OSSC? So I couldn't get the OSSC to work with it. I guess there's some settings that I need to configure. But we use what's called a SCART to HDMI converter. That's what we're using right now. Top left is closed. Okay. Oh, nice. Yes, yes. The shading on that trash can though. Okay. Well, let's try out a game, everyone. Let's try out a game. Let's see what we can get. I really want to see if I can get Defender of the Crown to work. Well, let's see if we can get this to work. Those converters are pretty good. They really are. Okay. So, okay, if I want to... I hope you can make the OSC work. The HDMI converter pitch quality is bad compared to Direct Scart. Yeah, but at least we got something, right? At least we started. And I'm happy with... I'm happy with at least just figuring out we don't see the trash can it's just for you oh man i don't see the trash can either oh wait let me hold on maybe i need to make myself disappear hold on let me make myself disappear no there it is okay all right you should try the different line multiplier modes Anastar, you're gonna have to send me like some kind of like how-to guide. You're gonna have to send me like a how-to guide so I can understand what to do. Okay, let's, let's, I know we can get the OSSC to work with the Super Nintendo. That we can definitely do for sure. I do have the remote, yes. I have the remote right here. Yep. Okay, let's try, I, wa I really want to try this Defender of the Crown game. Let's see if we can get this to work. So I'm gonna pop this disc out. I'm popping a work workbench disc out, which is kind of like the desktop. Might fix the screen cut off. Okay, let's see if we can do that real quick. I just don't want it to go. I just want it. I don't want it to stop working. You know. Let's see what happens. Format not. So Twelve eighty by seven twenty. I don't want to mess with it. Oh, we'll do this one. We're in NTSC. Okay. All right. I'm not gonna mess around with that too much. I remember playing that on the PC back in the dawn of time. I guess early nineties. Oh man. Okay. So let's see if Defender of the Crown will work. Everyone, let's test it out. I have no clue if this is gonna work. See what happens. It's thinking. <gasps> okay. Hi, De Niro. It does. I don't think it does. Boy. All right. Let's see if this works, everybody. Tell me about my day. Oh man, I had oatmeal today. It was pretty good. All right. I'm gonna turn this music down. Or I'm going to pause it for a brief moment and see um, what happens. Oh, no. See, this is okay. Here's what I was afraid of. Please replace volume workbench three in any drive. All right. That. A. When you get the OSC working. Yeah, I agree. It will be better. All right. Did 
open and find Defender Front. Defender disk out and put the workbench back in. Okay, all right. Okay, well, please insert volume Defender in any drive. Okay, all right, all right. You can do that. Sometimes you've got to switch out the disks. That's just how this works. happen yes we got it to work and we have sound come on don't do this to me don't do this to me f big f has a read write error let's retry sometimes this happens Sometimes this happens. Mouse, can you cooperate with me, please? Let's retry. Sometimes you just gotta hit retry. No, please. Please, no. Making a sound. Oh my god. No, we had- we- we won for like one second. Let's take it out and put it back in and see what happens. Damn, yo. They played us. Wow, Amiga, this guy put you to that level of trolling. Right, Brisby? Big oof. Let's see what happens. Okay, Frenum. Take care and be well. Thank you so much for coming by and hanging out. Try booting from the Defender disc. We'll do that. We'll do that. We'll do that. Uh, sometimes that happens, peeps. Sometimes that happens. Yeah, friend, I'm take care and feel better without the workbench disc. All right, let's see what happens, peeps. Sometimes this works. Sometimes this works for some weird reason. Hi, Divine. Hello, welcome in. How are you? I'll be so happy if this works. Please work, please. Please. I'm not gonna get happy yet. The bogus town. I can hear the music and everything. This is bogus town. Oh no, I know. Let's try again. Come here, window. again please please no it refuses it refuses to work peeps all right well rip defender of the crown he tried it must have suffered hey. some disc rot <laughs> one thing at a time yeah all right, let's try something else. Let's try um, Obitus. Let's see if Obitus works. For something else, I'm gonna try. Try another. The floppy disk is old, that's true. Let's try Obitus. What happened? We try Obitus. Please. Oh! I don't know what's happening. 
Please make sure you blow the dust off before you insert it into the machine. They're in, they're in plastic jackets. They're in plastic jackets, so I don't really think there's much dust. That any floppies work today amazes me. Those things are so fragile. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. I don't know if it borked. Let's try again. I think it borked. Owl, that's the psychosis owl. That's the psychosis owl. Where are you playing from? Them from? We're playing on an Amiga 500, Divine. This is an Amiga 500. We're using real hardware here. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. It's like thinking. It came up for one second. Come on, please don't do this to me. Not in front of everybody. Please. It's thinking. Thinking. It like, it's, it wants to work, right? It wants to work. I don't know what's going on. Crying. You all hear that? If you weren't streaming, it'd be working perfectly. I hear it, but I don't see anything. Or is this a magnetic personality de dad joke? No, we tested the Amiga Rubik. I took it to I took it to Amiga Bill and we tested it, and it's fine. Try control uh, Amiga. Try control Amiga to re. Control Amiga. I was teasing. Oh, got you. Got you. It started for like a second and then it stopped. All right, let's turn it off. And give it like a minute. And turn it back on. Because it was fine for like one second. It was fine. We saw the... Uh, we saw the... We saw the Psygnosis Owl. We saw it. Hi, Sleeping Forest. How are you? Left and right? Oh. All right. Please, please, please. Give us... Give us a game to play. Clean the drive? I don't know if that's possible. What happened? You also have to be very patient with these machines, right? Because it's like 35 years old, probably more. So we'll see. See what happens. Doing great. Thank you. It's like, you know, you just got to be patient. It's thinking. There we go. See? Just took a little bit of TLC. Just took a little bit of love and time. <laughs> it's like cable internet nice and slow. We got it. We got it, peeps. We got it. You all hear the music? Do I need to turn it up? Don't jinx it. I know. Got it. Look at this amazing intro screen. Getting it to work seemed like a game in itself. You can hear it? Look at this, this is so 
awesome! Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. Remember, no tips, no hints, no suggestions. These graphics fit on a floppy. I know. Well, there's three. This game has three floppies. This game has three floppies. We're streaming from the Amiga finally. Obitus is loading, everyone. Obitus is loading. All right, let's give it some time. Sleeping Force, thank you for the tier one sub for four months. I'm so glad we could figure this out together, everyone. All right, so we got to put disc two in. Wait, I don't have a second drive for disc three. Oh no, what does this mean? Comfy loading maps. What does this mean? Can I not play the game? Ruh roll. Is that a thing? Yeah, it is a thing. It is. Oh, what the French toast? Obitus. <laughs> I do. I actually do have a floppy drive, an extra one, but I don't know if it works. Oh my god. The struggle is real. What if you didn't have an extra drive? The music man said I should check you out. Yo, Big Shot. Hello, welcome in. Right now, okay, let me show you. We have an Amiga 500. Have you ever seen one of them? I'll show you. We do a lot of retro Nintendo here. This is my Amiga 500. Um, it's it's a computer system from the 80s and we're trying to get it to work, but everything is just turn the Amiga off. It's a good time to see if it works. Turn the Amiga off. Physical save icons. Hi, zombie boyfriend. Hello. So right now... Okay, wait. Hold on. That's so much dope retro stuff. Thank you so much. Yes, I... um, I My whole lifetime of collecting. This is a whole lifetime of collecting. How are you? Thank you so much. What do you usually play or do on Twitch, Big Shot? Thank you for coming in and saying hello. I really appreciate it. Turn the Amiga off and connect. I don't have an external drive, Brother Bill. You play Minecraft? That's so awesome. All right, looks like we're gonna have to try a different game, everybody. Obitus, Obitus, Obitus doesn't, doesn't want to cooperate. Obitus said, no, Ash, you can't play the Amiga version as you need an external drive. It's about you, not me. Oh, man. Well, welcome in. We're so happy to have you. We're so happy to have you. We're testing out games for the Amiga. Um, okay, let's test out. Okay, wait. Hold on. You have a game that's this two or that's two discs or fewer. Okay, you know what? We could try out Dungeon Master. Let's try out Dungeon Master. Let's see if that one works. Man, that would be super awesome if Dungeon Master works. Well, as a backup choice, there's always Rocky and Bullwinkle. Very funny. Very funny. All right, let's see if this works, everyone. If this works, oh my god. Can you just cram all the discs into one drive? Better fire your D20. Oh man, we're so happy to have you, Big Shot. We're really happy to have you. So, Dungeon Master takes a notoriously long time to load. How the 80s actually were. Oh man. I think it borked. Finish watching the game, saving the post game talk for after so I can catch some of this. Lemmings, let's try Lemmings. I think Dungeon Master borked. This one I'm gonna have to test out. Okay, let's let's try Lemmings. Please, please, please work. Please work. JRPG. Load times these days. I know sir. Oh my gosh, let's pray that Lemmings works. 
Okay. I'm praying that this works. Oh my god. If Lemmings works, I'm literally gonna cry. Oh my gosh! Yo, if we could play Lemmings right now, it's gonna be so amazing. Look at how cute! Alright, it's thinking. It's thinking. It's thinking. It's thinking. It's thinking. We have- we do have a Lemmings disc too. Oh my gosh. It's so cute. It's so cute. Okay, let's see if we could get lemmings to work. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so great if we could play some lemmings. Please insert the lemmings disc suit into any drive. The mouse button when add look at my mouse button it's a lemming hand it's a lemming hand yo we all play lemmings right now Oh my gosh, let's go. This is so cute. Look at the little sleeping lemming. Oh my gosh. Just dig, we're gonna play lemmings, oh my god, yes! First Amiga stream, lemmings worked. Yo, I knew lemmings would come through for us. Let's go. No! No, don't do this! Oh my god, no, please don't. What are you doing? Why is it doing that? Why is it doing this? I'm gonna be so sad. This is borked. No! Lemmings, please! Lemmings, please! Why did you do this? I don't know what to do. So I thought it was gonna work. Patience? But why is it doing- is that supposed to happen? Start. I'm pressing stuff on the keyboard. I don't think it's supposed to do that. Did it freeze? I have no clue. Same as Hourglass? Yes, it does. Yo, Fed, hello, welcome in. Who am I seeing here? Hey. We're, we're, pl we're, 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 um, testing out the Amiga 500, but it's borked. All right, let's try again. Let's try again. Maybe the diskette just needs to warm up. So we're we're testing out the Amiga 500. We put lemmings in. It worked for like a it worked for a little while. And then the second disc just 
sprigged up on us. How did my Capcom thing go? It was awesome. We had so much fun playing Capcom, Capcom Arcade um, Stadium. It was really fun. And we were on the GDQ channel yesterday. That was really fun and awesome. And we had a great time. Thank you for asking. How have you been? What did you do? I hope you've been doing well. How's Tux? I hope Tux is awesome. You're doing well? I'm glad to hear that. So, yes. Yeah, so, okay. Please work, Lemmings. Tux is the cutest. Tux is, like, the cutest pup. Hi, Toddy. Hello. Welcome in. How are you? And... Okay. All right. Dun, 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 dun. So Fed Tuck, um, Lemmings is a puzzle game, and this is running on the Amiga 500, and it's one of my favorite games. It's really cool. We're trying to get it to work. This game's hard mode will get me frustrated back on the day. Oh man, hard mode is tough. Hard mode is tough. All right. So, I'm gonna see. Hopefully, we don't run into problems again. It's just finicky, you know? Because the system is... The system is, like, 35 years old, you know? So, it's gonna be finicky. We've gotta give it some TLC. You know? We're gonna do our best, though. We're gonna do our best. Hope that it works. I'm also trying not to like move it around too much either. Got up to this door. If I see the game start. Oh, why? Life. Why are you like this? This, please. I'm sad, everyone. I'm very sad. All right. Rip Lemmings. Rip Lemmings. Rip Obatus. We're trying here. It's giving its best. It's it's really trying its best. I could tell. I could tell. It's trying its best here. All right. So Lemmings, Obatus, Defender of the Crown. None of those have worked so far. All right. Let's try. All right. These games are one disc. So let's try one of these that... Is only one disc. Yo, Bangs! Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Getting closer each time. We really are. All right. I tried. I'm trying one of these one disc games now. I'm the best. No, you're the best. Oh man. Okay. I don't know what's. Oh, nope. all right. This one just straight up said. This one just straight up said no. That one just straight up was like, nope. That was Demon's Winter. That was Demon's Winter. It was just like, Ash, no, please. Ash, please. We don't have time for that. All right, let's see what we got over here. Let's see what we got over here. This is a three-disc game. Spell... Spellbound. Maybe we should try Spellbound. Alright, we're gonna try this one called Leander. What we're playing today, we're trying to get the Amiga 500 to work. We're trying to get the Amiga 500 to work. That's what's going on today. If this one doesn't work, 
So we're going to try this spellbound one. All right, let's. And there's another one of these three disc games. Probably wasn't a good choice, honestly. Barbarian, you need a. Could play this without a. All right, let's see what happens here. I hear music. They have Lemmings, MS-DOS version, virtually ready to play for free on archive.org website. Yeah, that's that's true. I know a lot of these things are available on archive.org, but it's always good to see if you like... I just want to see if my original hardware works, you know? Yeah, whatever will load. Yeah. So, we have... Sound. We don't have a picture. So we might have to restart this one. Might have to restart. But the music is nice. The music is really nice. No? All right, let's try again. I just need to see if we get a picture. Oh man, I'm sorry that this has not been working out yet, everyone. Oh my gosh, I just want one thing to work. I just want one. Press fire now to skip intro music. No, but I want to. Hey, now that we have some visuals. I didn't see that before. So, we got some visuals this time. Amiga game. Bye. Traveler's Tale. Ooh, look how this one looks. This looks cool. It's not your fault. I really wanted it to work. Ooh, look at how pretty this one is. This one looks cool. All right. Yo, hi, Lich Dragon. Hello, welcome in. This Amiga, I inherited it from my father. It was his. So he's had it since the 80s. Since Amiga first came out. I like his music. I don't know if I'm supposed to have a controller plugged in. Play with the keyboard. Long load time. They usually have pretty long load times. Hi, Tonda! Hello! Hi, Chameleon! How are you? Welcome in! I'm pressing everything. Nothing's happening. Tonda, we're having bad luck. Nothing that I put in works. Hi. Yeah, nothing I put in works, Tonda. I need a joystick. I know. Metal sticks. We've gotten some things to at least show on screen, which is good. All right. So we need a joystick for that one. Damn, Leander. You played me too. Leander played me. That's okay. That's okay. Leander, we tried. At least you turned on for us. That was good. 
Sager! Hi, Sager! How are you today? Welcome in. I hope you're doing well. Everyone, please make sure to follow Sigur Bjorn, an awesome broadcaster who plays lots of Amiga, lots of DOS, lots of everything. I am struggling. We're struggling. We're struggling, Sigur. Nothing I put in works. Everyone, please make sure to follow Sigur. He's so awesome and really cool and very funny. Today is a chill chat, exactly. It's very chill. All right, we're gonna try Bard's Tale now, everyone. We're gonna try Bard's Tale. Let's see if Bard's Tale works. Bard's Tale 2, Destiny Night, please hold. Okay, please work. No! I swear I got Bard's Tale to work. I swear, I definitely did get Bard's Tale to work. Because I made, I made a team and everything. How's the Amiga testing? Sounds like it's been up and down. Yeah, floppy rot is a thing. I believe, I believe that's what's happening. I believe that's what's happened the whole night. Why it's not working? Oh man. Uh, hi, Mix Engineer Kid. Hello, welcome in. Hope you're doing well. Dang you, Bard's Tail. I swore I had gotten that one to work. All right, let's try. Let's try this one called Spellbound. Let's try this one. We're just going through every single disc we have to see what works and what doesn't. You could get a floppy cleaning kit from Amazon. Can you send me the link in Discord? All right. Spellbound seems to be working. Look at how cool this one looks. We get some music. Mystical. We're seeing a lot of cool intro screens. I don't know. I hear some music. All right, we got some cool music. Cool wizard man. I don't know if I'm supposed to wait or if this one needs like a controller too. This looks rad, it does. Okay, Emma, take care. Thank you so much for hanging out. I appreciate you. Have a good rest. The font is... It is very difficult to read. I agree. Graphics with an X. I mean, it, every blasted game with the controller. Oh my god. I don't have one. Good night, Emma. Good night, Emma. Oh, we'll put that in the we can't do anything about it pile. Uh, okay. Failure, failure, failure. Try the left mouse button. I have a Genesis. I do have a Genesis controller, but um, not um. Oh, actually, Vol, you're right. I don't. I, I only have a USB one from my Sega Ma from my Sega Genesis Mini, not like an actual Genesis controller because I don't have a Genesis. 
Yeah, old school. Actually, wait a minute. Hold on. Will my Sega Master System controller work? Will my Sega Master System controllers work? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I have a Sega Master System controller somewhere. Get a GoTech or an. I have a GoTech. I have a GoTech. It should. I have a Sega Master System. Yes. I'm looking for the controller. It's right here. The controller might be back there. Hold on. I have a GoTech, Sigur. I just don't know how to configure it. But I do have one. Hold on. Hold on, everybody. Make sure you turn the Amiga off before plugging. Okay, it's off. Hi, Mike Zilla. Hello, welcome in. Yes, here it is. Man, it's the same thing. What? Same. It's the same. The most tried and true ET game. It's the same, everyone. Look. Look. It's the same. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I'm plugging it in. Hi, Trainer Kojo. Hello. Okay. Goltech is easy to install. You just replace the drive with it. Okay. I have one. I do have one. It's right here. It's on my desk. Okay, let's put Spellbound back in. Floppy with it, jump for it correctly. Bob's your uncle. Oh man. <laughs> we'll see. Okay, let's see what happens, everyone. Let's see what happens. Hi, Jimmy. Hello, welcome in. Let's see if this controller works. Sega Master System controller should work fine. Okay. Ray. Did you say Bob's your uncle? Or am I sometimes bugging Lodi? I did. Cause Singer typed it in chat. Bob's your uncle. Hi Lodi. I hope you're well. All right, I'm pressing buttons. Do I have to wait for it to load? Commence. This is a game called Spellbound. I have... What port did I put it in? That's a good question. I put it in the mouse port. It says... The mouse port... The mouse port... It's port two. One is the mouse. Oh my god. Yo, I, sw I swear we're gonna get something to work one day. Yo, thank you so much for the follow. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, I swear. I swear we're gonna get something. I promise. I thought we had to put it in the mouse port. That was the correct thing. He's bad. All right, there we go. Plug the mouse back in. All right. Ah, my hair is caught. My hair is caught in a tonberry. Okay. Hi, TDX. When you put it in the wrong port, I know. 
Okay, okay, wrong port. The OSSC is an upscaler. Yo, thank you so much for the follows, everyone. I really appreciate it. It's an Amiga game, not Psycho Mantis. All right, here we go. Let's see if we can get it to work now. Oh my God. Thank you so much for your patience. That was an instant classic. Instant classic. All right, here we go. Please work. We almost got Lemmings to work. You got Rainbow Six Siege and it's kind of fun. That's awesome. That's so awesome. What system did you get it for? Okay, here we go. Let's see if this works. I put it in port two now. PC? Oh, that's great. That's so great. Did you watch me struggle with lemmings the other day? I did a bit. Yes, I did. It worked. That's a bingo. That means we could go back. Okay, I can throw, but I can't jump, it seems. Oh, I gotta press up. All right. Where's the music? Oh, the Scorpio's gonna get me. I didn't expect this from the title screen. Me neither. <laughs> Just using one button. Okay. All right, we got rid of, we got rid of the Scorpion. We got it to work! Yo, finally! This is the first game we've gotten to work all night, and we've been broadcasting for an hour and a half. An hour and a half. I gotta make my own sound effects. Oh shit, I died. Bloonk? There we go. Akapella, go, go. <laughs> Hi, gorilla. Hello. Oh shoot, we fall. We fell. Bloonk? <laughs> Wait, did I run out? I think I ran out of. Pellets to throw. We do have some sound. Okay, Sigur, take care. Thank you so much for hanging out. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. I think, I think everyone that I'm gonna... Okay, there we go. Eye of the Behold. Yo, Volt, don't... Oh my god. If I could get Eye of the Behold... Amiga games were a trip. If I could get Eye of the Beholder to work on this... I would absolutely play it. I love Eye of the Beholder. I died! What happened? I love Eye of the Beholder. We beat the first one, and I'm playing the second one um through GLG. But I haven't beaten the second one yet. Alright, I have no idea what I was supposed to do there. But thank oh my god, we got we got one to work! I have the boulder. <laughs> Is that what it said? Oh, man. I just... And you know what, Lodi? I just installed this, like, um... OS... This, um... Closed captioning thing into this, um... Plugin into OBS. So... I was hoping this one would be better. Really silent? Because the title screen has music. Yeah, the game is actually silent. Closed caption tries so hard. It really does. Okay, here we go. Oh, you can play two players with this, it seems. What happened to my weapon? Oh, I just got a key. All right, there we go. No, no! Don't. All right, we fell the scorpion. Felled it. Okay, here we go. Oh, you have to press up. I can't get past this. Look at these graphics, everyone. Oh my gosh. Am I supposed to kill that thing? I got hurt. Okay, I guess I was, I am. Died. I don't know how to get that. Okay. All right. Falling gets through it. Uh... What is this thing? You have to hold the button down for you to shoot your thing. Oh my god. 
The OBS plugin uses Google to do the speech attack. Works pretty well most of the time. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure it's it's probably me. You know, it's probably me. All right, what do you all think about this spellbound game? Very interesting. We get good laughs. Very interesting. What was the one that needed a commercial? Uh, oh, Leander. Let's try Leander now that we have a controller. Let's try Leander again. All right, spellbound worked, everyone. Yay, we got it to work. We got we got it to work. Oh my gosh. Compared to the other, it's interesting that it works compared to the other games. I know. It's so great that it got I got we got that one to work. All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, here we go. Hopefully Leander works. Hi, Okan. Hello, welcome in. How are you? Press fire to skip intro. Please no disc, no disc swapping. And you know what's funny? Before, Lemmings wouldn't work. And we got Lemmings at least turn on. I love the era no network game. Didn't know why that happens with me. No signal. All right, let's see. Get this one to go. Oh, Scarab redeemed Ash shows an item from the gaming collection. Okay. Um. All right, hold on. Let me get something for you. I feel like. Okay, while this game is loading. We will show Scarab. I have some really cool, some really cool coins that I've gotten from the Nintendo store. So this is a Splatoon coin that I got. It's really cool. It's in this plastic case. The Splatoon 2 on the back. It's pretty heavy too. And it's at least two inches wide it's really really nice it's really nice yeah it's got this the squids on it i really like this one and then i also have a super smash bros one this is when smash bros ultimate came out it's got like the little smash logo on the back this one came from, I don't remember where I got it. I think Best Buy. I think I got this at Best Buy. I can't remember. Or it might have been the Nintendo store. And then I have this one that I got from Breath of the Wild. When Breath of the Wild first came out. This one. That one's pretty cool. Hey. I control all delete. Hello, welcome in. How are you? I hope you're doing well. Thank you for coming by and saying hi. I hope you enjoyed that scarab. Thank you for redeeming Astro's items from the gaming collection. Oh, thank you so much. I had so much fun. Yo, look at this intro screen. Hi, Grunt. Hello, welcome in. How are you? My mailing list, you can send those to me. Very funny. Control all delete. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. We're playing some old school Amiga games, Grunt. We're we're trying to get this Amiga to work. We failed for most of the games. 
That was some high quality animation. It really was. All right. Looks intense. Yeah, I can't wait. I can't wait to see what the actual game looks like. Please insert disc two and press fire. All right, everyone. Wish you luck. Amiga, yeah. So we're gonna insert. We're gonna insert disc two. We're gonna insert disc two, and hopefully this will work. happens right far so good yo look at these graphics go west of the cave and collect the teleportation key and travel east of the teleport okay you gotta find that key find it hi t girly it worked These mystical ass games so good. Heck yeah. Oh man, it worked. They respawn. This one looks awesome. Okay, why? No, 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 come on. I hope there's no timer. Was it common for Amiga games to not have sound effects? I don't know, honestly. Good question. You just punch, no weapon. Oh my gosh, please don't. I died. There's literally one button. Oh, don't worry, Brother Bill. Okay. Don't worry, I understand. Yo, we have music. They spawn you right where you died. I know. Okay, here we go. Hopefully... Yo, this this dude has like the greasiest feet I've ever seen in my life. Uh oh. Yeah, there's like no sound effects at all. Oh shoot, watch the spikes. I died. I can duck, I can duck. Oh, I can kill that? <gasps> oh, dip. The music is the sound effects. Do I need to turn the music up any louder? Is it good? <laughs> they only do sound or music, really? Do you see a game that does both? Got you. The music is good. Good in your end? Yo, cute but shy, hello. It's good to have you, I hope you're well. We don't want that treasure chest. How do I get the treasure chest? Yo, Wild Cyclops, this is my my dad's Amiga 500. No! This is my dad's Amiga 500 that we're playing on. Oh man, I keep dying. At least it's- Oh, wait, I only have one life left. This is also on the Sega Genesis under a different name. It is? This is Leander. Yes, Smash, this is Leander. Yes. You saw about the OSSC? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The OSSC, we're not using the OSSC with this because I couldn't get it to work. Because there's probably some like settings that I don't know how to like change. But um, we're using a SCART to HDMI converter right now. But I want to get the OSSC to work. Yo, this game is pretty dope. All right, no. You have no idea how hard it is to control. He's like super slippery. Galahad, it's a tough game. Look at this game over screen. Oh yes, Cyclops, you should, if you ca if you have the opportunity to get an OSSC, I mean, a, um, Retro Tank, I highly suggest it. I really love my OSSC. I love that. It's so cool, right? Yee, hi, Jen. Hi, Broom. Is it more slippery than Luigi? Yes. 
Jin, how are you? It's so great to see you. Yee! What's the difference? I think there's more capability. I think grunt. No, honestly, I'm com. I am very ignorant as well. So anybody, if anybody in chat knows, please tell me. But basically, from what I've seen, is that with the OSSC, it's a line doubler. The latency is extremely low, <clears throat> and um, you can use RGB, uh, RGB consoles. Consoles that have RGB output. Please insert this one and press fire. Sorry, I don't know how to read. You're well just having some tea? That's awesome. I had some tea earlier and it was so good. RetroSync only has composite in. Ah, uh, yes. And the OSSC has like... RGB and it has SCART. It has a bunch of stuff. Please insert coin to continue. Exactly. Exactly. Yo, I'm so glad we got something to work. Look at this animation, y'all. Yo. There are also retro tanks with RGB component connections. Oh, nice. All right, I'm guessing we're gonna have to swap. We're gonna have to swap discs again. I'm so glad we got this one to work, everyone. Oh man, we got a game to work. We got a game to work. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. It's exciting. The animation's really good, right? I know. Look at how great these graphics look. You have to insert this one and two before playing. You have to, in yeah, like you have to swap. You have to swap the discs. All right, here we go. All right, we have to go this way to find a key, apparently. No. Oh, come on, don't kill me. Um. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. So my armor changes color when I take a hit, everyone. My life, oh, I've been, oh. Let me tell you, while Cyclops, I have been addicted to the My Life in Gaming videos. I've been watching all of them. I've, that's how I've been teaching myself about RGB. All the swaps take forever. Yeah, I could tell. Well, this Dragon's Layer 2 has six discs to swap. Only Amiga makes it possible. True. Ow. I think I'm about to die. But yeah, I'm super happy. Got this to work. Insert disc 3 to use inventory, basically, right? No, I don't want- how do I get that? Oh my gosh. Alright, I'm gonna just ignore that treasure chest over there for now. I'm so glad that I get to share this with you all, seriously. And we know that it works. We know our Amiga works. And I'm so happy. All right, let's go up this way. No, come on. Frick, man. Y'all have no idea how like slippery his feet are. Okay, jump. No, don't move. Okay, how am I supposed to do all it is? Thank you for the lurk. The color changing is so cool. It really is. Okay, okay, we made it. All right, all right, all right. We're doing, we're doing pretty good. There's a blue treasure chest up here. Let's get it. Oh, we got something. I don't know what that did. Crisco level feet. My life in gaming's analog frontier series is really dope. Feel better than loading for the audio tape. You go to sleep and get up and the game's still loading. 
Yo, we did- we made the jump. Let's see if I can make the jump over here. Alright. Wait, I don't know if I'm supposed to go- it said that I had to go west first. It said I had to go to west- go west first to get the key. Yo, we fell all that way and did not die? That's a miracle. Thank you for the follow, I really appreciate that. Alright. This is as far west as I can go. Alright. Amiga, because who needs real friends when you have your best pal? The game does look pretty intriguing. It's interesting. But it, that quality though? Yo, Brian, how are you? This is a game called Leander on the Amiga 500 we're playing. And so far, it's been- it's pretty cool. Oops. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to go in there? That seems like- that seems like it's like a place we could go inside of. No, I need you to jump across, friend. No, oh my gosh. I died. I like- I like the color swap thing. I said I need you to jump across. Destiny 2 modern gamer who just happens to watch Retro 2. That's awesome. The walk cycle is super fluid. Why won't he jump across? Oh my gosh. You could clearly do it. He doesn't do it when I ask him to do it. There we go. Oh my gosh. Game. It's making it's giving me rage. All right, this is it's my goal to get across it finally. Thank you What is that No I swear I died oh My gosh, why? Jump. Yo, this is rough, y'all. Looking for a rage emo from Ash. The um the um Lil Mac is my my rage. Oh yeah, there we go. Everybody wants me to put put the other rage emote back. If I get another emote slot, I will. Congratulations, you have a high score. That rage Ash. It looks like she's always smiling. Oh man. Okay, I'm gonna put. I'm gonna put AAA because I don't feel like putting my name again. We got Leander to work, everyone. I'm gonna keep trying. I wanna try this game one more time. To... I want my rage emote back. I know. I know. I know. Oh man. I'm so glad we got this to work, y'all. I'm so glad. And thank you for the hot tip with the Sega Master System controller. That was a hot tip. That was good. That was good. Okay, here we go. You have to be patient with the little times here. Very patient. So I'm going to put Leander in the this definitely works pile. Because that was pretty cool. Well, Spellbound worked too, actually. Yo, thank you so much for the follow. Punch. Alright. At least we know the Amiga itself is fine. Maybe some, like, disc... Like... Like the the disc cleaning or like the um the drive itself. Atari controller works too. Hi, Shower Killer, hello, welcome in. Showa Killer, hello. How's it going? We're just playing some Amiga 500. Alright, here we go. Let's go this way. We didn't go this way before. 
We got treasure chests over here. I think I got hit. That stinks. Alright. There's a chest over here. Like Sager said, I'm sure some disc rot, but I think that's a hope. I think so too. I think so too. I'm sure some of the discs did rot. I'm sure. better with the jumps getting better with the jumps everyone you have to be very patient I almost got hit right there oh please don't go in here oh oh we can that's a press down Oh, we're in a cave! Look at this! Awesome. There's bats! I hate bats. Alright, please don't... Bats? Why? Why, though? Look at this! What is this? Oh, damn. I got... I think I got what I'm supposed to get. These are better. Bats in any game are super annoying. Just program bats. Damn. Alright, we got wrecked. Alright, we made- Hi Talos! Hello, welcome in! How are you today? I hope you're well. You're coming by and saying hello. Christmas. Alright, we got whatever we're supposed to get. I I was down earlier, but I'm better now. Oh, I'm sorry to hear about that. I'm glad you're doing better, though. I, I'm glad. Me too, Brother Bill. I'm so sorry to hear you weren't doing well. We're making progress! Level 1 complete! Jump left off the easternmost cliff to reclaim the crown from the chest, then journey to the gate in the- Oh, we got horses now? They got horses now? Oh, snap. Up here. A treasure chest. Alright. Got something. Oh, there's like a goblin up there. I can't get to him though. I can jump and hit, which is nice. Oh, not high enough. Alright. Maybe we need to find some kind of weapon or something to, I mean, some kind of special power up to let us jump a little higher. Hello! The player character looks like Dragon Ball era Chi Chi. Yo, I could totally see that. How are you? Welcome in. We're playing on the Amiga 500 right now. This is my dad's original Amiga, and we're playing um a game called Leander. Really cool. All right. Let's see what happens. Please enter disc one, all right? See what happens when we enter disc one. Making some progress, peeps. Progress. All right, let's go. Entering shop. Oh, we made a, sh we're in a shop now. Okay. Okay, let's go, let's go.
Uh oh. Not good. Enter just two for shop options. It's it's hung up on something. It's hung up. Because it just keeps going. Greg. Ash was even figuring out some Linux stuff. I don't know, everybody. If it continually... Hi, Partial Fracture. Yes, this is the Amiga. How are you? Welcome in. We're playing a game called... We're playing a game called Leander. We're playing a game called Leander. It's hung up, everyone. It's hung up here. You have the Genesis version of this? Nice! Yeah, Grunt was telling us that there's a Genesis version of it. Damn, yo, we made it all the way to level two. Might need a percussive adjustment. Has fire to skip in. I don't know what's going on. There are a lot of Amiga and Genesis games that are very similar. Yeah, 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 like Shadow of the Beast. We can also play Shadow of the Beast. Well, at least I had that one working before. Like this the game same processor as the Motorola 68000 oh neat I just really love how beautiful this game looks I really love how beautiful it looks it looks so good feel like with all the intro screens we saw, this one looks closest to the game that we played. I'm really sad also. Very different graphics, sound, architecture though. Yeah. It's the same process that our Atari ST. Yeah, I really, I really am so glad that we at least got one to work. The original Max. Nakatao, thank you for the host. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Alright. And then if we can't get this to work, we can always do... I mean, if we can't get all... If we can't get a bunch of other games to work, we can always do, like, a point and click. I've been wanting to start, um... Um... Quest for Glory. Bearboo, thank you for the host! It was all over the place. The X68K and a bunch of arcade systems. Yo, Bearboo, thank you so much for the host. I hope you're doing well. I hope you and your puppy are doing great. Good evening. Is It is loading from a floppy, yes. Yes, it is. It's loading from disk one. We're going to have to swap disk. Floppies weren't reliable even back in the day. Really? I'm good. She's currently sleeping on me. Just chilling before I get some sleeps. Oh, that's lovely. I'm doing very well, thank you. Holy floppy disk, Batman. Hi, M. Coltron. Hello, welcome in. How are you? We're playing on the Amiga 500. All right, here we go. We're going to insert... Right now, game will turn on. Hi, Kremitz. I hope you're well. How are you today? All right, so you know what we'll do next time? We'll just avoid the shop unless there's like absolutely have to go into the shop.
Have I played Top Banana yet? No, what is that? Not bad, gonna get it at a new old pool game myself. Nice! Remit, I hope you had a great day. What is Top Banana? Tell me about that. We have to do this for everyone. Yo, Mac! Thank you so much. How are you? I hope you're well. Yo, I am so... I love this music. Mac, I hope you're having a great day. No! I did not mean to do that. <laughs> yeah, it's stuttering a little bit. I have to switch to the Super Nintendo soon. Top Banana is a very strange game for the Amiga. I don't think I have it. Yeah, he did take good care of it. There was a time though when, um, because a lot of this stuff was in the basement, um, there was some water damage in the basement. So I don't know if any of that stuff like affected. I don't think. Thank you for the follow. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Okay, random username. Here, thank you. So I really appreciate it. Stuttering a little bit. Ow. I've never played- I played Top Banana. It's terrible. Clone of Rainbow Island with very confusing graphics and horrible sound. It's not the greatest use of the Amiga capabilities. Got you. Taxi, I hope you're well. Thank you for coming in and saying hello. Yo, American Dream! Noble effort last night. I felt your agony watching Rocky and Bullwinkle. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Rocky and Bullwinkle... I never played that game in my life ever so that was a learning experience i'm doing great this one guy how are you today thank you for coming by and saying hello don't do it again what is the speed running record of that game i would really love to know rocky and bullwinkle is rough yeah, we played it on the um Super Boss Super Boss Bros yesterday. It was so fun. I had so much fun. I used to watch Rocky and Bullwinkle. I used to watch the cartoon. I definitely used to watch the cartoon. But oh my gosh, the game. Yeah, that was something hey. else. Hi Alex, how are you? Welcome in. How's it going? I hope you're doing well. Thank you for coming in and saying hello. Messing around with some Pokemon move while watching. Oh, that's awesome. Are you like search are you hunting for Pokemon? Our own what wait, remember wait wait wait. Hold on. One Amiga game that I love is Turrican, The Final Fight, which has some incredible music. Composed by the German composer Chris Holzbeck. Yo, the, ca the quality looks awesome, Mr. Peabody? I s wait, wait, wait. Okay. Remember the cartoon? What was the one with the boy and the genius dog? Oh, yes, I remember that. Yes, I do. Floating World 2. Any percent or world record is 3 minutes 5 seconds. Wow. Okay. I think I have to go to the... But yeah, this game is really cool. I really like it so far. Peabody and Sherman. Yes, that was it. I'm so glad that I- oh, damn. I did not know that there were spikes there. 
I think I think we found the shop was over here. There's some rocks. So we have to be careful. Dudley do right. Thank you so much everyone for hanging out with me too on this random Saturday broadcast. Okay, let's see if we can get the shop to load up this time. If it doesn't, we'll try a different game. Used to play it late at night on Nickelodeon. Hi, Tristina. How are you? Welcome in. It's good to have you. All right, we're going to try this one more time. And I hope you're doing well. It doesn't get hung up like. I got hung up. Remember that on network TV? Yeah, no, it got hung up. It's worrying. Just worrying and worrying and worrying. All right, I think the Leander fun is over, but that was really cool. What did y'all think of Leander? I think that was really interesting for what we got to see. I know. I'm gonna have to see if there's some ways that we could put these on the gold tech. It was cool, right? I'm gonna have to see if there's a way we can put this on the gold tech, y'all. If anybody knows how to use a gold tech, please. Okay. All right. Let's see what else we got. We got something called Overlord. We got Obliterator. Let's check out Bar. Let's see if Barbarian will work. Let's see if Barbarian will work. Check it out. We played this on Ant Stream. All right, all right, that's promising. Will be easy. Okay, you have to teach me, Brother Bill. Oh, what? All right, we got something going here. No! Oh, okay, that was fine. That was supposed to happen. No, okay, fine. That was supposed to happen. All right, let's see. Hey. Ash making true Wind Waker link faces. Yes. All right. Yo, Barbarian. I don't know what I'm... I don't know why it won't start, though. Am I supposed to do something? Oh, there we go. What in the... I know. This game is hard. Look at that Hulk. Things work. Sometimes they don't. Yup. <laughs> Whoa. Psygnosis made some games with impressive visuals. It really... They are so pretty. This is clearly New Game Plus. Yo. Ty, how are you? Welcome in. Oh, we're supposed to use the... Oh, we gotta use the mouse for this one. Press any key to begin the quest. On. Excuse me. Oh, we got. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Wait, wait. I didn't know I was supposed to use the mouse for this. What? What is going on? This is like MS DOS Classic. We're playing on the Amiga right now, Ty. Yo, Bruzy, how are you? Welcome in. Some kind of flex. They really went hard with the cover art. Wait, 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 how do we attack? Oh my gosh. Wait, how do I... G wait, stop! Stop moving! Hold on! Oh my god. Uh-oh. Oh my god. Hi, Mr. Peanut Butter. Why is it hard? 
why why are the controls with mouse? I don't understand. Why wouldn't he control with the controller? All right, go. Let's attack this dude. We killed him. I killed him. All right. Okay. All right, I didn't kill that guy. Oh, I did. I did. I wanted to try something a bit different. Unfortunately, it didn't work that well. The anime show you run into the wall. Would you recommend this? I don't know. E money bags. Hello. Some kind of jank Prince of Persia. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. Hi, Star Lord. Hello. Welcome in. Thank you so much. I hope you're doing well. You never seen controls like this? Me either. I've never seen controls like this. Wait, did I die? You have failed in your quest and your life is forfeit. You've completed 4% of Barbarian. Think if this style took off and this is how we played games. Oh my gosh, this was very strange. This is very strange. All right, let's go this way this time. So weird. All right, so. Oh, shoot. At least it works. That's true. 4% is something. At least it works. Alright, let's see if we can attack this. Alright, we killed it. I'm just spamming the button. Coming to America? That's one of my favorite movies, Star-Lord. Coming to America is one of my favorite movies of all time. You're gonna play a game and relax? That sounds lovely. I hope you enjoy. Oh, damn. Gotta go and click through the movement. Link is watching this intrigued. It's very... Okay, this one, I don't know, y'all. I'm glad that it works, but that one is hard to play. That one is definitely difficult. Real about this game, it seemed as if they used the mouse and icon approach to try and get around the problem that a lot of joysticks only have one button back then. Some later Amiga games made use of joystick joypad with two independent fire buttons. I, one day, I awoke in a field, sword in hand, ready to take a walk and kick ass. That is definitely what happened. Okay, so let's hey. make a pile of games that work. I do not hate retro games. <laughs> Okay, so this is the pile of games that works. Let's make this a pile of games that work. Hi, Hugas. Hello. Hi, Connors. That game seems not made for fun. Tell me about it. Tell me about it. All right. Lemmings. I'm so sad that you didn't work, Lemmings. Obita seems to have worked, too. All right, let's hey. try... Yo, yo, N7, this isn't worms. Thank you so much for the 10 bits. Just walk by everything. It did kind of look like that. It did. Okay, let's try this game. It's called The Killing Game Show. Oh, thank you, Star Lord. Thank you so much. We're going to try this game called The Killing Game Show. Let's try this one. Let's try this one. Oh, N7, thank you so much. I hope you're doing well. Thank you so much. All right. We'll see what happens, everyone. I don't know if this needs a controller or not. That means it didn't work. That was Psygnosis mouse control game. I know. You know what's okay, though, Texi? I do have Lemmings um, that we could play on the... Super Nintendo at least, so at least we could play it in some fashion, and I have it on the PlayStation. But I am also sad that it didn't work, because that's one of my favorite games of all time. And a warning when me and my daughter start watching Glee, she won't even let me leave the chat. 
Look at these visuals. It caters for joysticks with two independent fire buttons. You played it for the first time recently. Nice! Look at how good this one looks. Okay, Dorian, thank you for hanging out. Thank you so much for the raid. Thank you so much. And have a good rest. We'll see you soon. You have to try and get from the bottom of an area to the top before the ever-rising liquid at the bottom touches your ship. If it even so much as soaks your feet, you're dead. Got it. Look at these impressive animations. Where the main character accidentally gets into a war between the ninja clans because his dumb self gets his bike stolen for one of them during a ninja chase scene. What? Thank you for the 10 bits. Hi, JP. I'm well. How are you? All those graphics on an 880k floppy disk. Seriously. Seriously. It's incredible. The Amiga had some great intros. It did. It's really cool. Have I played Psycho Force since it came out? I'm playing it now and it's just as Metroidvania as Castlevania. But it's hard. No, I haven't. Is it on Steam, Nekatao? You did? Oh, Star-Lord, I'm so sorry that I missed that. I'm so sorry, Star-Lord. I'm so sorry. All right, we got Castlevania double pack. There we go. I don't know how I missed that, Star-Lord. I'm sorry about that. All right. Yo, Die Hard, so we're using a SCART to HDMI converter now. We tried using the OSSC, but it didn't work. Well, I, I didn't, I couldn't change the settings. I like, I couldn't figure out the settings. It does work. I just couldn't figure out the settings for the Amiga. But we're going to try it out later. We're going to try it with the Super Nintendo later. There's a version of the original version of Castlevania for the Amiga. That's cool. Yo, this music is good. It is. Thank you so much for understanding, Star-Lord. Sometimes the chat goes by kind of fast. Okay. The Amiga had excellent sound chip. It really did. All right. So music F9, start, return, sound effects F. Okay, so we'll hit return. Hang on a sec. Killing Game Show will continue shortly. Please insert the Killing Game Show disc two. All right. Music is so good. I'm glad that this one is working. Nice assorted guitar sample. for the follow. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Yeah, this one's really good. It's so amazing. It is so good. Fire to continue. Good luck. Okay. Okay, so up to jump. I can't jump up there. Uh-oh. I guess that's the water. Dang, yo. Don't forget that the last life will be replayed. Okay. Wait. 
Oh, where's I supposed to go? Oh man. How do I get up there? Oracle? What does that do? Oh, you could climb! You could climb out the walls! Okay, okay. We can climb out the walls, peeps. Uh oh. You can walk up walls. Oh man. The Sega vibes. Triple lasers, let's go. Okay. Does it run out? Alright. This is cool. Okay. Okay, we can walk up the walls. Definitely. The ammo besides where it says triple lasers is the bottom of the screen. Got it. Yo, it's so good. Okay, I don't want to go down. Maybe I have to? I don't know. Oh shoot, I fell. Uh oh. Okay, okay. This one's a little tough. We got this. We got this. I don't know what Oracle does. Okay. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna make some progress in this. Alright. Getting some points. There was a heart thing over there, I missed it. Damn. Bugs. Okay, I guess we're supposed to go this way. I don't know if I can get up there. Okay. Oracle looks like a secondary tool that you have to activate somehow. It does. I'm pressing the buttons. Nothing's working. Oh, we ran out of darn. We ran out of our triple. Triple laser. Seems like... I don't know how many lives I have. I wasn't paying attention. Christmas. Okay. I guess when that countdown happens, that means the water starts to rise. My lives are in the top right corner. Okay. Okay. Do I should go this way? No! Time to jump. Go. That's where I wanted to go. Go this way. What happened? Climb this wall. I'm determined to at least make it to like a stage two or something. Right? Should I go this way? Yo! That music slow down. Oh, we got lasers! We got lasers. Okay, maybe- oh, No! Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Alright. Give me that heart. Oh, the heart went away. Okay. Damn! I did not mean to fall. The water. Man, we were doing so good too! Oh my gosh! I was doing so good! Alright, let's go. I made it- almost made it to the end of the stage! Aw, oh, fiddlesticks. That makes me sad. Okay, we're gonna go this way. I don't know.
I like the triple laser. Pretty cool. Jumped up this way. In that heart. On. But oh my gosh, yo. The controls are killing me. Controls are killing me here. Oh my gosh, I swear. That water, I feel like the water is creeping up on me. Oh. Try again. I, I didn't do so bad. I didn't do so bad. Yo, MQG, it's awesome. We we were struggling getting some to work, but hey. now that we've gotten some to work, it's been good. Hi, Severb. Hello, welcome in. Yes, I did, Texy. I did. And I think that is really, really awesome. I did notice that. Oh, I like this laser. I think I went the wrong. Uh, water's the water's creeping. Water's creep died. They give you a, at least they give you a lot of lives to start with. I like that. It's unforgiving in the sense that it's a little tough, but the, at least it gives you a lot of lives. I finally got some games to work. It's amazing what we can do in the 80s. I agree. Man, my health is very low. I keep running into the enemies. That's the problem. Oh my gosh, my health is like almost gone. Comp All right, let's try again. Let's try again. I'm so glad I can share this with you all. I'm pretty sure that there are tutorials on how to get the OSC to work with the Genesis as well. So I get, I did get it to work with the Super Nintendo. Um, Die Hard, I did. It was just the Amiga. This is the Amiga. This one, it, it, I wasn't able to get an image uh, to display. But yeah, you're right. I'm sure that there's a way to get it to work. I just haven't discovered it yet. We will discover it. We will. I'm just glad that we got this to work. Period. The Amiga. Because I didn't think I would get any of the games to work. I'm I'm super happy that this is working. Oh, we got the triple. Awesome, we got some health. Are you kidding? This is a vibe. I have no idea. I've been sitting and watching. I have no idea what's happening here. Hi, HC Willard. Hello. Super dope seeing the OG hardware. The Amiga was cruelly treated to a lot of lazy ports in the Atari ST. It's 1989 Psygnosis release, Shadow of the Beast, which really shows the Amiga could do in terms of visuals and sound. It was nowhere as impressive as the machine could handle. Yeah, I have Shadow of the Beast. I have Shadow of the Beast. It's such a great, it's such a great game, but it's really tough. Hi, Pixel Chong. How are you? I hope you're well. Thanks for coming by and saying hello. I appreciate it. Playing some games on the Amiga today. It's been a blast. I'm so happy that I get to share this with you all. Seriously. Stop. Oh my god. They drained all my health. You're okay? I'm glad to hear you're doing well. It drained all my health, everyone. 
I think we have to start over. Look at the water, it's coming for us already. Alright, let's start over. Amiga 1200. But hold on, I'll read that in one second. I will read that in one second. At Retro AVS to play all my NES games. Yes, oh yes, Pixel Chunk. I did see, and I totally meant to respond. I'm so sorry that I didn't. Um, I have all of those games. I do. So it's totally okay. But thank you so much. Thank you so much for offering. I'm so sorry. I really did meant me bond. I don't know what happened. Those flying orbs are booty. They sure are. Got it. Seems when we kill all of an enemy that you get a heart. Hi, Boy Wonder. You saw Super Mario 64 road content I shared? Yes, I did. Oh my god, we clipped through the wall. I did see that, MQG. Thank you for sharing that. Yo, Baby Mage, hello, welcome in. The heart stuff flows upward when you have defeated the whole wave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, that's what I'm learning. All right, we have to start over. Friggy might just thought I'd offer. I don't keep doubles. I hear you. Yeah, I feel like I feel like though. Um, if I were you, Pixel Chunk, I would hold on to that Mega Man Five. That's very difficult to find. Very very difficult. How to capture footage from AVS with Elgato? What is the output? Is it a RGB console or is it a S video or like what kind of output does it have? Oh. I think we lost our triple lasers there. That'll put, that'll go up to Got you. Ammo ran out, yeah. Sometimes when I'm reading chat, I uh, miss what's going on. Most creative Star Wars level, in your opinion, is Retro Remix. It's like Super Mario World style Fortress on Super Mario Bros, but it was tough in some ways. Yo, we did it! We beat the level! Hi, Extreme Apple Fan! I am well, how are you? I think holding down fire will use a secondary one. Yo, Severb! Thank you for the 100 bits! Wait, wait, wait. Holding down fire will use a secondary item. Oh! Mac! Thank you for the 50 bits. Okay, holding down fire will use a secondary weapon. Okay, I'm gonna try that. And, uh, I'm gonna try that. What? No! Are you serious? Guess we have to go this way. Oh my gosh. Oh no, please. Side shot. Oh look, we got a new we got a new weapon. 
You're making pizza for dinner? That sounds like a good idea. Oh man, it's not working. Oh, shaped key! Oh, damn! Oh man. We had the shaped key! This music is so good. Okay, shaped key. Here's the key place. Can we use the key? Oh my god, you have pizza today? Oh man, okay, well I feel accomplished that I beat the first level in this. So let's move on. And let's put this in the games that work pile. Let's put this in the games that work pile. I'm very happy to see that this one worked. Let's put this in the games that work pile. We'll move on. That game did look cool, right? It looked, it lo it's tough. It's definitely tough. We need some egg rolls and pork lo mein. Oh my God, HC wizard, that sounds awesome. All right, let's check out Shadow of the Beast too. Let's check out Shadow of the Beast too, everybody. You should share your pizza. Always share pizza. Always. While this intro runs, everyone, I'm just gonna go use the restroom real quick and I will be right back. So I'm gonna let this intro run and I will be right back. I will be right back. We're having a pizza party. All right, I'm gonna let this run. You guys enjoy. I'll be right back. Bisu is the worst of the three games. The first game is the best. I need to I need to find the disc for the first one. Boy. Please insert Beast 2 disc and fire one ready. Hey. My favorite pizza topping is pepperoni, mushrooms, and black olives. He's missing the amazing amazing intro scene. Oh, I did watch it once before. I did watch it once before, so I have seen it. All right. Just hoping. This too. Fire one ready. This one's got good music. Heck yeah. Worst game of patty cake ever.
That sounds awesome, MQG. You found the sound follow that music? Oh, thank you, Mantle. You like jalapeno pineapple on my pizza? Oh, heck yeah, Willard. That sounds awesome. All right, here we go. You love the intro music? It's so good. Beast 2, big bad beast beat down. On it, I don't understand how people can eat just plain cheese pizza. Oh man, if you've had pizza in New York, then you would know. Hi, Solace and Dread. Hello, welcome in. Okay, look at this. I up is the jump. Okay, look at how good this artwork is. Jug, hello. Oh man. Most places don't get it right. Try New York pizza, trust me. Flew over to New York for a week long solo holiday, mid 2018. I had a wonderful time. Less than a block away from two bros. That's what I'm talking about. Texie, I'm from New York. I'm from New York. So, that's, um,. Two bros, I used to eat at two bros like every day for my lunch break. You're from the UK? How did you enjoy your time in New York? I'm in New York, plain cheese is good. Yes, Willard. Thank you, Shug. Thank you for the lurk. I love seeing retro games you never heard of. Thank you, Toddy. I'm glad I could share this. You want some roses? Me too. This game is stuttering a little bit. Look how beautiful the graphics are. Oh my gosh. I felt the need to change my username. Hi, Ronald. It's your username. You should definitely change it if you feel like you should. A lot of them have similar accents to me. I have fun going around looking for self several filming locations as well. Typical tourists might do. E.g. the ride. The ride is fun. I used to... So I used to be in Midtown a lot and I used to see the ride drive by all the time. And when I would see it drive by, I would totally wave to them. I'd be like, hello, hello, hello. It's so funny. But yeah, I think that's awesome. Oh no, we died. He would do that. Yep. But yeah, there's like, I think some popular filming locations were always like in Brooklyn. People love, they love filming in Brooklyn, especially like Law and Order. Along to New York, New York. That is so cool. Look at these visuals. This game is so beautiful. This music has some soul. I sought out filming location with Saturday Night Fever, which is largely shot in the Bay Ridge area of Brooklyn. That's awesome. I, I love Bay Ridge. Some of my best friends live in Bay Ridge. Got, you grew up on Hollywood sets since my dad was a special effects tech? That is so cool. You know, when I went to the Harry Potter studio tour, one of my favorite areas was when they showed all the special effects and stuff. My dad studied um, film when he was in school, and he did special effects on a movie, like, way back in the 80s. But I always thought that that was, like... I don't know. I always thought that that was like one of the coolest things you could ever do. Like Foley artists, special effects, all that kind of stuff. I think it's like, I think it's like one of the best things you could do. Look who's here, everyone. Sweet girl. Sweet baby Bobby. Yes, Kuro. How are you? 
where John Travolta's character work on SNL was still there. You even find the house that doubled for the house in which he stayed. That is so cool. My sweet baby's here, everyone. Oh my god, she's like, why? Why? Okay, Bobby, go do cat things. Wait, wait, let me put... Hold on. Let me put just chatting so you all could see her. There's my baby girl. She's purring. Purring. She's a purring girl. Oh, oh my gosh. We worked on a bunch of flicks and TV shows. I'm all jaded now. You rather just teach? Do you, so do you teach film? What do you teach? If, if it's okay to ask. Always good to see you. So great to see you, Kuro. Bobby's being a sweet. I know. Oh my gosh. She's being a sweet. Wait, where I put the control? Oh man. Street that Travolta strutted down in the opening credits of Saturday Night Fever. The pizza place you see him buy pizza from was still there and still looked the same. That is amazing. Hi, Gun Guild. Hello. Bobby's always a sweet. Oh boy. <laughs> she is. Gun Guild, I hope you're doing well. Thank you for coming by and saying hello. And everyone, thank you for... Thank you so much for hanging out with me while we test out the Amiga stuff. Hi, Tricky. Hello. You teach electrical trades at a college, but you're going to school again to get a degree at a, as a counselor. Health and wellness at your college, that's incredible. I wish you the best of luck. I also went to Duther City and saw the buildings that double for Norman Osbal Osborne's mansion in the 2002 Spider-Man movie. Texie, you know what I will always also suggest to you? If you go to Queens. Go to Queens and go to Silver Cup Studio area in Long Island City. There you'll find a lot of stuff too that will be interesting to you. You know? Queens has lots of great places to film. Where they filmed. Like, Men in Black was filmed in some parts of Queens. And Coming to America. One of my favorite movies. They filmed that in Queens and Brooklyn. Saw some Spider-Man locations. Nice. Yes. Having a full-time job, full-time school, having my kids every weekend. Yeah, exa I hear you, Willard. Other boroughs, Queens, Bronx, and Brooklyn. Hell yeah. You got to. Hey, hey, hey! Get. This game's stuttering a little bit. My T Sharp Barber Shop. There you go. Exactly. Yes, Queens is awesome. Oh my gosh, why is this game so hard? Help, help! No matter, I'll take you instead. Oh damn, we died. Yo, this game is hard. Amazing Caribbean food in Queens is true. They ju they have two. LaGuardia's in Queens and... um. Well, yeah, JFK is in Queens also. He's on like the Queens, like... Brooklyn border was a clinch thanks to that superb subway system. Yeah, week long. Uh, yo, JR2! Thank you so much for the raid, JR! Hi, Birdie Gertie! Hello! Everyone, please make sure to check out JR, an awesome broadcaster who's on the incredible andromeda arcade team he's really really awesome please make sure to go check him out hi chiz chiz knees hello hi scm hello welcome to the raiders of the not so lost ash hello welcome in jr what were you playing today sorry i missed it in the chat we're playing um we're playing amiga games 
Little Nightmares, how's Little Nightmares going? I hope you're doing well. Thank you so much for choosing our channel to raid. We're so happy to have you. How's Little Nightmares going? What did y'all talk about? Hi, Jazzy Monk. Hello, welcome in. If you've never been here, hi, my name is Ash. We play lots of Nintendo and Retro today. We're playing from, we're playing from something called the Amiga. It's a computer-based, con. Uh, it's a computer. It's from the 80s. The cool mic show, hello, we can't flex, but here to raid, yo. Yo, thank you so much. Thank you so much, JR. So we're playing on an Amiga. We're, we're playing, it's games on these floppy disks. We're testing out which games work and which games don't. Because some of them have been working and some of them haven't. So this is the hardware. It's right here. That's the hardware that we're playing on. This is my dad's original, um original amiga from the 80s and we've just been testing out lots of games to see what work and what doesn't work and stuff so it's been really fun thank you so much i really appreciate you thank you so much we played through the whole series this week i read all the comics that is so awesome Well, thank you so much for sharing your community with me. I really, really appreciate it. The Amiga computer is what Star Wars was to the film industry. It was truly ahead of its time. It really is. With the sound capabilities and the visual capabilities and like everything about it. I especially, cause you know, like didn't a lot of film industries used to use the Amiga for like its sound? capabilities and stuff and with the video toaster and the effects that it can do i think quite a few people used it for that you know but thank you so much jr that's very kind of you to share your community i really appreciate it and welcome in i've never heard of this until now it's really cool oh it's awesome it is so awesome so many great games are on this computer and um the community for the Amiga is absolutely awesome. Help, help! Please don't! No, no, no! I didn't mean to- Oh god. I'll take you instead. It isn't fussy, what? Oh gosh. Can I kill this thing? Push! Thank you so much for the raid, Push! Oh my gosh, thank you so much! How are you? Raid full of snacks. Let's go. Push, how was your broadcast? What did you play today? Thank you so much for sharing your community. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. How was Guilty Gear? In the UK, the Amiga was a colossal hit, especially when Shadow of the Beast came out. And Batman the movie. Yeah, I wish it was more of a hit here in America. But welcome in, Raiders. We played Knockout City and Guilty Gear. That is so awesome. How are you doing today? Everyone from my channel, please make sure to check out Push Play the DJ, an incredible broadcaster who also loves wrestling and is super talented, funny, loves re um, retro games as well, plays Sega, um, Dreamcast, and all that kind of stuff. So I, I thank you so much. It was good beta version, so it's a bit wonky. Well, thank you so much for choosing our channel to raid. Tonight, we're playing from the Amiga 500. We're playing Shadow of the Beast 2 right now. And we're getting, we're trying to get some games to work. Some games have worked, some games haven't. But we're playing all kinds of cool, cool things on the Amiga 500. And it's really awesome. I'm so glad to be able to share this with you all. So, this is where we are right now. Although, I think I'm about to die. This game is super tough. Yep, there we go. I knew it. So glad to see you doing so well. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. I really do. Thank you so much. Oh, man. I'm so happy to be able to share this with you all. Hi, Bum Fluff. Hello, welcome in. How are you today? I keep dying in this game, everyone. 
I don't know if I'm going the right way or not. Maybe I'm supposed to go the other direction. Let's check the other direction. Okay, JR. We'll see you. We'll see you when you get back. And if you need to lurk, I totally understand. This music sounds like it could be in an 80s movie, like in Top Gun or something. Right? To me, that's what it sounds like. It does. Try again. Definitely wrong. Can you all hear the Amiga working? The Amiga A500 only costs us Brits 400 pounds or $700 upon initial release. Judging by what I looked up, an average PC would have cost a lot more than that back then. And the Amiga also had some serious applications released for it as well as games. No, it's quiet? Okay, good. Yeah. My dad also had the paint programs for the Amiga too, Texi. He had the paint programs and a lot of the music programs. And I have like a MIDI chip, which basically can sample music and stuff. All right, let's see if we're supposed to... One passes through our woods. Excuse me? Yo! So that's not the direction I'm supposed to go. Yo, we definitely got murked really fast. That was terrible. I think I'm done with Shadow of the Beast 2. At least we can put this in the pile of games that work. We can put Shadow of the Beast 2 in the piles in the pile of games that work. So, let's count that as a win. We can count this as a win, everybody. That was rough. That was a little rough. Alright. Yay! Shadow of the Beast 2 works. Okay, let's try... This one called Overlord. Let's try this one called Overlord. All right, let's see what happens. Peeps. Overlord of overlords. Hi, Waluigi. How are you? Welcome in. How was your day? All right, this one's working. We also get desktop publishing programs. Gold Disc released one called Page Setter, which was the price of two full price games. Professional Page 4, which is even better, but quite a bit more expensive. You could also get structured drawing programs, which graphics can be enlarged without them looking blocky. That is awesome. Golden Axe Warrior, yes, MQG, yup, tomorrow. I hear you, Waluigi. Okay. Alright, I don't know if this game needs the mouse. Yo, Retro Revelations! I'm well, how are you? Okay. This one's a mouse game. Alright, view opponent. Fine. Spell, spell, wait, what? Galactical Domain, what is going on? Born, okay. Strategy game, play some Rock Band 3, awesome. Mouse only, okay. Mouse only, here we go. And this one's working hard. Hi, Gray Fox. Hello. Welcome in. How are you today?
doing some serious thinking. I hope you had a good day today. How's it going? All right. Working. That's good. You can put this in the pile of games at work. Code incorrect. Page 22, first paragraph. We have to put in a code? Hello? Code incorrect! How, wait, how do I know? Oh, man. This one's copyright protected. I love the fact that they added a keyboard to the mix and reintroduced the three-part vocal harmonies. First introduced in the Beatles rock band. Oh, yes, I remember that. I remember that, Texie. Oh, man. Twitch is a great site. I love it. All right, well, Overlord works, but we just need to figure out how to get past this copyright protection. That's lame! But we can put it in a pile of games at work. Dang, man. That makes me sad. Find the correct pirate wheel from the Secret of Monkey Island. I can Google the manual. Alright, is it worth it? Should I, should I do that? Do you all think it's worth it? Sorry, I immediately assumed Twitch was being- Oh, no, no, no. It, it's the game. It's the game. It's the game. It had some copyright protection. It was pretty funny. Those pirate wheels are online. Oh, man. Okay. We'll try that one later, then. We'll try that one later. We'll try that one later. Let's try Obliterator. I'm glad we can put so many pot in the pile of games that work, right? Rock Band 4 shed the keyboard, but at least a vast majority of the DLC songs and those exported from previous Rock Band games could be re-downloaded on the newer console at no additional cost. Yeah, that's good. Wait, did we try this one already? I think we did. Oh no, maybe we didn't. I'm glad that this one works. Mouse icon as barbarian. It does, Texy. Oh, here we go. Look at this. Hey. Hey. Boom. Look at this interesting intro. Look at this! Oh my gosh, it looks so cool! These graphics are so awesome. It's like art. Like, I would totally frame this. I would totally print this out and frame this. Creepy old man shooting you in the face is always a great intro. Man, I'm so glad that we could get this to work, everyone. All right, I think after this, maybe this will be our last game and then we can move on to the Super Nintendo. What do you all think? Press any key to begin the mission. What happened? Guru meditation! No! Where's Amiga Bill? We got the Guru meditation! Oh no! Oh no! Rock Band 4 and the Xbox One came with the Legacy Adapter, which allowed Rock Band and Guitar Hero wireless keyboards and drum controllers. Which was bonus, as it meant it's not necessarily having to shell out for new instruments. Oh, it's not anti-piracy. It just means that the game's not working. That's a creepy screen. 
Oh no. Is it a bad thing? That laughing? <laughs> no. It's creepy? It is? I don't think it's supposed to be... It's not supposed to be scary. It just means the game doesn't work. Oh man. But the disc is really cool looking. It's like your computer is going to self-destruct the Guru Meditation screen, but it's red. I think the disc looks pretty cool. Alright, so this goes in the pile of games that don't work. Okay. Let's try this one. It's called Revenge of Defender. Try this one. Game's not working is scary. Let's try this one. Since that one didn't work, we'll try one more. You miss old 3.5s? Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. If you like Psygnosis Game Art, search the artist Roger Dean. Oh, yes, I know Roger Dean. Oh, yes. Definitely. Definitely. Alright. Let's see what Revenge of Defender is all about. Please insert data disk in drive and... Sorry, got twisted up in the game. Benny dresses nine millimeter. What? The game was rigged from the start, huh? Blank disc to save the game. We need a blank disc. Data disc. I don't have a blank data. Disc, disc error. I don't have a blank disc. I don't have a blank disc. I don't have a blank disc. Oh, uh, well, at least this one works, though. So we could put this in the it works pile. We could put it in the it works pile. That's good. All right, we'll try one more since we didn't get that one to work either. What happened? You can still get fives on Amazon. The statistics are starting to sway in the disturbing path. Even old school games need memory cards. I guess that's true. Alright, I don't know if this one's gonna work. Oh. oh okay. That one doesn't work. Or we'll have to try that later. Tried this sword of Sodan. Did Amiga use 5.5 discs at all? No. You're hungry, Shaolin? Go get some food. You're Bobby causing trouble. Bobby, what are you doing? out there trying to get my attention all right sort of sodan works something oh all right all right all right that's good that's good look at this artwork i love the font beautiful Very awesome. This looks nice. It does. What is it doing? 
Oh, this is fancy. Well, look at this art. Oh, man. Hi, Phalanx. <laughs> I lost my mind. Movement and magic. Hi, Thorin. Oh, this is the credits. All right, I think this one uses a controller. Hey. Even the ones that didn't work. I like that all your games are the best. <laughs> That dream wave screams 90s. Yeah, it said, I think it said 1988 or 1989. Oh man. I think it's hung up, everybody. It's just, it's doing the same thing like, um, Leander did. Dang. That's dang. Oh, so much for Sword of Sodan. Sodan. 1987. Oh, got you. All right. Last one we'll try. Whether this works or not is blood money. Got to change the floppy disk. No, that one, that it tells you when to change it. It tells you when to change it. Let's try blood money. Hey man, blood money on the Amiga, sweet. Look at this art, oh my God. This is original hardware, lost my mind. This is, a, this is an Amiga 500. This game has the best music. When you shoot enemies, First, many of them... This was menace. Now, Psygnosis presents a DMA design game. We got voice acting? When you shoot enemies, many of them dispense coins, which ideally you need to try and collect and spend on extra weapons in the shops that you see scattered around the street level. Yeah, this is, this is, um... Oh, sweet! Hi, academics! Oh yeah, lost my mind. Amiga is a way ahead of its time. Yo! This is awesome. You know, lost my mind. It's funny because this wasn't that popular in America. That's, I think, that's what was the biggest thing. I'm doing well, academics. How are you? Please insert disc two and then fire when ready. All right. Buck Bumble for the best pregame music. This is dope. DMA design went on to make GTA and turned into Rockstar. I didn't know that, Brian. I didn't know that. That's really cool to know.
All right, here we go. Yo, look at these fonts, though. Uh. Make sure I was right. That's cool. Boy shouting, shut your mouth and look at my one slang money. Oh, wow. Yo. Oh, it's a shmup! Oh, snap! All right. Okay, we found a good one. We found a good one, y'all. I guess I can't shoot those. Uh, found a shmup. Found a shmup. You were wasted. What? This looks awful. It does, Kremit. <laughs> if this is a really weird Star Wars game. Awfully good. <laughs> oh, man. All right, I have two hundred dollars. All right, let's try again. All right, let's try for this one this time. This is Rockstar. All right, let's try again. I'm glad we could get this one to work. I right, could put blood money in the working games pile. Game is good but hard. Everything can kill you fast. Yeah, I'm noticing. Yo, we got like a flying submarine now. Oh, we're underwater. I guess each vehicle is a different world. Look at how fluid this animation is, everyone. The animation is so fluid. Davy Jones equipment locker. I have 40. Oh, I don't have enough for anything. Hello, nurse. Welcome in. How are you? I hope you're doing well. The underwater. Duh. Duh, Ash. 60 frames per second was the norm. The Amiga 500 was released in America in October 1987. The name of this game is called Blood Money. It's called Blood Money. You just fly into any coins that you collect and defeat the enemy can be used to upgrade your weapons. We all live in the orange submarine. Hi, Anthony. This looks like our type. Yeah, it's interesting. It's very interesting. All right, here we go. We're gonna try a few times. All right, let's try the first world again. Kill something that it drops coins. Blood money, exactly. It makes so much sense now, right? Our type did come out for the Amiga. That is so cool. Yo, I'm so glad we got this to work, everybody. Oh my gosh. Music is baller. And I keep dying here. I wish I had more lives. I'll be super. Ow. Kenneth, hello, welcome in. How are you today? I hope you're well. Dang, I I I died really fast. I died really fast there. All right. From you can buy extra lives. Okay. Tough luck, sucker. You were wasted. Damn. The game does not hold back. We made much harder for your choice when you decide to wear a hat. Wait, what? 
I'm doing well, Kenneth. Thank you. I'm having a good day. Guru meditation? No, I was laughing so hard. I know, it's really funny. Yo, Hyrule Love! Thank you so much for subscribing with your Twitch Prime. That means the world to me. Thank you so much. Oh, my Mario hat? Oh, yes. I love my Mario hat. Turn off the music and have the sound effects instead. They're impressive, too. Oh, really? Hold on, I was trying to see what it said to show the music. Pressing F3. Okay. I pressed F3, but I don't know if I got it. I can have music or sound effects, not both. No, not both. Okay, so next time when we get to the menu, we'll hit F3 so we can try it out. Hey. Look at how smooth everything is. Dang, I keep dying. Oops. The title Blood Money sounds like a prequel to GTA. Well, it's um it's made by apparently the company that turns into Rockstar. Thank you so much for that prime sub, seriously. Every single enemy on screen, yup. Okay, wait. Press F3. Alright, here we go. X, okay. Oh, that's what you meant? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, F1. Okay. Thank you, Scarab. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Oh, nice. Oh, we got sound effects. Have sound effects now, everyone. Game is fun and two player. It looks like it would be super fun. Damn, I got wasted. All right, let's see what I can buy. I have 150. So I can buy. Buy this. Oh, we got an extra missile now. What? Alright, neat, neat. I love the animation of the those red and blue spheres. And yo, no, 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 no! Don't come after me. Uh oh. All right, we're making some progress. We're making some progress, peeps. I don't have enough money for equipment. We may- we're- wow. Wait, how do I get- What? Ow. Those blue toothy things don't kill you, but they do drain your money. God. Yeah. We made progress! Wow, we made it farther in the level. Alright. You have to shoot those in the center to get them to rotate. Yo. Yo. Hi, Nick. Hello. How are you? Welcome in. That was really cool. That was very interesting. That was really interesting. All right. 
So, I don't know if I'm gonna play this one again. <laughs> Most games like that, they would just kill you. All right, actually, let's try, let's try, um, let's do the other planet. To the other planet. Let us do the other planet. See what the sounds look like. The sounds sound like there. Is the game randomly freezing for you? No. It doesn't seem like this. Is that Sam is farting? And a submarine to start with. Each player only starts with 200. Got you. Yeah, let's try this one. Hi, Dark. Thank you so much. You like my shirt? This is one of my favorite Donkey Kong shirts. I really love this shirt. Alright, here we go. It's like, it's freezing a little bit. Like, it's stuttering. It is stuttering for me. Oh my god. Hey. I like the sound effects. You like the sound effects better? I do- it's easier to play the game with sound effects. Versus- versus the music. Alright. I think- I think I'm done with this, yeah. Can not really help? You're taking damage? Oh, that's what the whooshing sound means? I think we we played quite a bit of Amiga. I think we're yeah. I think I think I'd like to move on to Super Nintendo for a little while. What do you all think? I really had fun with this. I really had fun with this. What did you all think? That was a really interesting experience. I really liked it a lot. I really liked it a lot. What did you all think of the Amiga? I'm so glad that we got it to work. Super duper Nintendo. Hi, Pearly Gates. You have this game in the original box? You have blood money? That's so cool. You have only just begun to scratch the surface. Oh, yes, Texy. I know, and I can't wait. We'll do more for sure. And two copies of the game. Play one with sound effects. The other one just plays the music. Yo, that, yo, that would, yeah, because then you'd get both. Then you'd get both. But yes, oh my gosh, I really had fun. I really had fun sharing the Amiga with you all. And I'm so glad, I'm sorry that so many of the games didn't work, but we did get a lot that did work. We did get a lot that did work. It's from your dad's? Yeah, this was my dad's Amiga too. This was my dad's Amiga. All right, so I'm gonna put these games back in the little sleevey things, right? And then here, let me play some music so it's not just like silent. Down a little bit. Team 17 also did some games with impressive visuals and sounds. Alien Breed Project X and Body Blows. The Gold Tech, the experience will be better. Yeah, I think you're right. I think you're right, Void. I, I am gonna, when I install the gold tech, I think it will make life a much easier. I don't know the physics of how it would work. I don't know the logistics of how to get around the legit legalities of stealing your entire room. You get, you get as old or even older, the Amiga is a wonder you still work like you used to. Oh man. Well, this is awesome. I'm so glad that I got to share this with you all. I'm gonna put this... Okay, so these games definitely work. I'm gonna put blood money in the working pile. These games... I'm, I'm gonna keep this in the working pile too. That was cool. I really am so glad that I got to share this with you. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna put this on a Be Right Back screen. Amiga... Yeah, Amiga games are 3.5 floppies. Yup. These are Amiga games. Yup. I'm gonna put y'all on a Be Right Back screen. So I can, um... So I can... Clean up the room a little bit and then, um... Get the Super Nintendo out. And then we'll use... 
I know the OSSC will work with the Super Nintendo, so that's what we're gonna do. Across the pond from the managed to experience something that was massive success. The Commodore Amiga. What kind of floppies went to the windows? 98? I think it was also 3.5s. You wanna look at the room? Okay, I can leave it on. I can leave it on if you all want. I can leave it on. Stop. Hey everyone, I just wanted to pop in to let you all know. Oh, no, no, no. Am I right? Am I right, ads? Ads, am I right? Trying to hide the room to sneak away with it. No, I just didn't know if y'all would want to see all of that. Oh, man. I've been dying to play some Animal Crossing, y'all. I've been super dying to play some Animal Crossing. So this worked really nicely. I'm really glad that we got this. I'm so glad. Who adds, I know. So tell me about your day, everyone that came in. I hope you all had a great day. I hope you all had a great day today. I'm so glad that I was able to share that with you all. It was really fun. Hi, Booty Bandit. Hello, welcome in. Wait, does this go? Oh no, I think this is for the. That's for the power adapter. So the cleanup work is just gonna be boring, like moving the stuff around. Today, Saturday. Today, Saturday, right? Da -da. It is lost my mind. All right. It is. It depends on where I am. Eastern Standard Time. Yes, it is Saturday. It is. It could be Sunday if you're from the UK. That's true. That is true. Sega Mega Drive Genesis controller should be compatible. Oh yes, we were using a Sega Master System controller. Taxi, that's how we were playing. It's Sunday in the UK. That's how we were playing with the Sega Master System controller. Oh, look who's here. Look who's here. Bobby is back. He's like, what are y'all doing? Why am I not a part of the fun? You having a great day waiting for the fighting game community roundtable? Nintendo Direct for fighting games? Where all the big fighting game devs come to tell us some cool things? That is so awesome! Cat stream, Meow Mix. I know, she already ran away. She already ran away. That is so cool! So what games are you waiting to hear? about nurse what game are you wanting to hear about she wants me i think she wants food what is the present in the background this one this one it was a christmas gift i got an animal crossing themed christmas gift that i got for christmas on that website i was looking at earlier today All right, we're gonna move this over here. We're moving the Amiga over here. Two blue mushrooms and a red mushroom. Oh, these? These are candy. MKG, this is candy. What's inside? I'll show you. It was like Animal Crossing. My 
like Z Ma Mika Zelda. Mika Zelda, thank you so much for the raid. How was your broadcast? Welcome in. What did you play today? Hi, Mika. Thank you so much for sharing your community with me. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. What were you doing? How was The Sims 4? Hi, Mika. Cute and cuddly raid. We love cute and cuddly raids. I hope you had a great broadcast today. Tell me about what you did on The Sims. Thank you so much. I should check the videos of Vic mix of Animal Crossing and Doom. Wait, what video, Nico? Hi, Chuck. How are you? Working on a legacy challenge? That's so awesome. So here's what I got. It's... Look. It's Pascal in the water. Isn't that so adorable with seashells on the bottom? You see all the shells? The person made it, sculpted it, and painted it. They sculpted it and painted it. That is so cute. I'm well, Chuck. And they made the box. They made the box and everything. It was so nice. So nice. I'm so happy with this. And it fits my room perfectly. But yeah, Chuck Taylors, I had a great day. It's a YouTube search for Doom Crossing. Oh, got you. Street Fighter V, Guilty Gear, big stuff coming in fighting games. Some of the smaller companies have dark have have gone dark for this event, so I want to see what they have been so secretive about. Got you. I got you. I understand. I understand. Thank you for sharing that. First, I appreciate. Okay. Okay. So I just gotta make sure. Glad you're doing good. She sells seashells by the seashore. Hi, TYBD. Hello. The big black bug bled black blood. Whoa, that's a good tongue twister. All right. All right. Yeah. Fires from in there. Hold on, I'm just getting organized. I'm getting organized. I'm putting this back as well. I'm running out of space here. I hope I hope you all had fun with all that Amiga stuff. There's so many plush. You need to do a 24 hour stream. You just show everything off. We did do a room tour. Everyone, please also, please make sure to check out Mika Zelda's channel. Make sure to give Mika a follow. And thank you so much for choosing our channel. Twix, Tweed, and Trent, quite near to Stoke, a big bloke's ba black back broke. Wait, a big bloke's black back break block broke. Trying to find space to put things. Oh my gosh, you have no idea. The struggle is real. The struggle is real, Chuck. All right, because we were doing all this cool Amiga stuff. I was showing everyone all my Amiga stuff. So things are everywhere. I have diskettes and stuff everywhere. Really came together. Thank you, nurse. I know how you feel. Thank you so much, nurse. Yeah, I put a lot of work and effort into making this room look awesome. Yes, they are. They are lost my mind. They definitely, definitely are. Next time, everyone. Here, next time. Next time, we'll try this one. Double Dragon for the Amiga. Next time we'll try this one. I think that'll be a good one, right? What do y'all think? And see here we have... We have Deluxe Paint. We have Deluxe Paint. Just wanna live in this room. Okay. I need to play- oh man, Endless Ocean. I love Endless Ocean. Double Dragon games are always fun. Yup. They are so good. They're so great. 
Okay, hold on. Thing is, so you can imagine how much I know. I know you gotta love Endless Ocean. It's pretty crap. It had trouble development, but Double Dragon Two was better. Taxi really makes me sad to hear. It makes me sad. Okay, there we go. This one's a little bit broken. I have to be. This is the pile of games that work, so I'm gonna keep this on the side here. Trying to jump out of my body through the monitor into that room. Oh man, yeah, we'll definitely do another room tour. Definitely do. I know everybody really loved that. All right, we're ready for the Super Nintendo. Computer ports of Double Dragon range from disappointing to exceptionally poor. The Commodore 64 point is especially bad. Oh man. Alright, let's get this to everybody. Is the Super Nintendo? How do you know where to start? When to do that? Mario Paint? Oh, we could totally play some Mario Paint. All right, here we go. What game? Right now we have you and Squadron in here. The room stream. Where did I start? Where do I start? I start with the shelves. Because I feel like the shelves would be interesting. Like, there's so many things on there. I think it would be interesting talking points. And then I will go to the plush. Do I own wild guns? I don't, but I know it. I know it. I know wild guns. C64 version of Double Dragon is so bad that there's an apology in the original instruction manual. Which had to excuse the fact that almost all of the people in the game had noticeable gap in their ways. Oh my gosh, really? What? That is nuts. Okay, everyone. Now what I'm gonna need is a Super Nintendo controller, which is in here. No, actually it's here. And then we're gonna need the power adapter. Oh my god. Sorry, everyone. There's wires all over the place. I have a Super Nintendo as well, although the console itself and the cartridges are very different from what you just showed us. Yes, there's a, um, there's a version 2 to the Super Nintendo, right? Okay, here's the controllers. Wild Guns is on the Switch. Here we go. Here's the controllers. And now I just need the power adapter. Right? Power adapter. Okay, let's. This is what we need. This is what we need for the Super Nintendo. Back your characters and a dog is a big deal. So this time you're going to stream from the actual Super Nintendo. Yup, MQG. One squadron on the SNES is fantastic. Oh, Taxi. Taxi is one of my favorite games. Taxi, it is one of my favorite games. We could even start out with that if you want. It is certainly one of my most favorite games of all time. Tell you right now. Here we go. See, I have everything all organized. I have everything all organized. I think so. There's a reloaded version. I wish I had a gap in my imagine being losing a bunch of weight because nature screwed up on the Twitch that someone is streaming from actual SNES hardware and not the SNES classic. Okay, here we go. Here's the adapter for the Super Nintendo. Here's the adapter. Okay. Wild Guns reloaded. Wild Guns is a fast paced arcade style shooter mixed in the Wild West. With steampunk, as you play Clint, Annie, or Doris, or Bullet the Dog with his sentry drone. Oh, interesting. Interesting. 
Hi, Bobby. Welcome back. Bobby is here to troll me. Hey, right, everyone. Here we go. So you ready? Now we can hook up the Super Nintendo. We can hook up the Super Nintendo. I've never played Zombies Ate My Neighbors, but I know that it's supposed to be really fun. Called the SNES Mini. That's what we call the SNES Clan. Oh no, I have one. Yeah, that's we call it the SNES Mini too. I have one. It's up there somewhere. It's up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's behind the Zelda box. You see the Zelda box? The SNES Mini is right here. Yeah, we call it both of those two. It's very fun. Yeah, I hear Zombies Ate My Neighbors is really awesome. Alright, so we're gonna put... So here's the OSSC. We're gonna put... This, um... SCART cable... Into the OSSC. Right? The SCART cable is inside. And we're gonna plug this into the Super Nintendo. That's the only one that has Star Fox. Yes, it's the one that has Star Fox 2. Hi, Def. How are you? Welcome in. We're setting up our Super Nintendo. We're setting up the Super Nintendo. Okay, and then here's the plug. Is also on the SNES collection. In Europe, the tie was shortened to just zombies. And the chainsaw wheel that enemies were replaced with axe. Wow. That you are able to lose entire consoles. You know, there's there. We have natural camouflage being surrounded. The yup. This Kirby music is so good. I know. That's a major problem in this room. Lost my mind. Major problem. All right. own checked i don't nico i don't i don't own that one okay thank you so much for the follow i really appreciate that okay here we go all righty everything should Ready. Ready. Oh, I just need to plug the HDMI into OSSC. Good to go, everyone. Good to go. What happened? Oh, I love this song. All right, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Should be good, I think. All the wires are all like, all over the place. Europe and Australia, sometimes this brings back memories. Yes. German, about certain types of violence. Oh, Contra Alien Wars. To super pro protector alien rebels. Oh, and all the human soldiers are replaced as robots. I have so few video games and still not convinced you aren't just streaming from Nintendo HQ. Oh man, I wish. I wish. Alright. Okay. My six-year-old was geeking out in your room. He wants that cappy. That big time. Oh, man. Lord Kaladar. Oh, wait. Lord Kaladar. That's so funny. I'm glad. I'm glad he's enjoying seeing everything in the room. I'm so glad. My child neighborhood so much. <laughs> okay, let's see what happens here. On everyone.
cold. Yeah, the Super Nintendo works. Here we go! For real hardware! Here we go. Yo, you and Squadron, let's go. Oh man, I've been itching to play this so bad. Mode 7. Let's go, we're taking off. How's the sound? Is it good or is it too loud? Let me know. Yo, it looks so good, right? You got Odyssey over Christmas and now he's really into Cappy. Sound is fine. You loved you and Squadron? All right, well, here we go. Here we go. Where's my second controller? Sound is fine? Okay, awesome. Um, my controllers. Uh, controller's not working. Dun, dun. Wait, what the hell? Why is there no... What the hell just happened? This controller is not working. I think I have two of them. Alright, hold on. I gotta switch a controller. Controller is not working for some weird reason. sticks that's okay this one so much mm like music and un squadron the capcom composing team Daisy penny have mario pajamas i wanted them but my dad got me ninja turtles did you plug into the right hand socket player one needs to be in the left hand socket no it's the controller the controller wasn't working the controller wasn't working i'll play on hard mode i could unlock gamer mode but i need the other controller to be working for me to do gamer mode all right we'll stick with we'll stick with shin Thank you so much for the follow. Got him a set of three Mario pajamas. All right, here we go. I love this game so much. How does it look on your end, everyone? Mario Kart overalls. It looks like real hardware. Nice, Jen. It's because of... Yeah, yeah, it's Area 88. Oh, yeah, no, I know, Texie. This is one of my favorite. I watched all the anime. I watched all the anime for this. One is Mario Kart, the overalls kind, and the other is just various Mario and Nintendo characters. That's cool. Got him a super soft lease of Mario Cappy. That is so cool! Oh, it stays on hard mode. I'm sorry, I could not allow that. I could not allow that. First death in the first level. I also love SNES Donkey Kong Country. The second one, Taxi! Oh man. The second one gave me so much trouble. Hi, film crew. Hello, welcome in. How's it going? Older sister made all three of her brothers link cast in her favorite colors. Come on. Are you serious? doing very well film crew how's your day going 
I hope you had a good weekend. You're having a good weekend. I'm having a great day just hanging out, playing some Super Nintendo. We're testing out the OSSC right now, which is working really well. It's really, really awesome. Guy's name is Shin Kazama. Jin Kazama? Yes. In Tekken, yes. Have you ever played this? It's only my second time here. We're so happy that, that you decided to come back. And that hard mode competition completion runs. It's going on at work doing laundry. Got you. You're at work and you're doing laundry? I don't know what level I what level I chose. A little early for this one, but we'll get through. Crap. Oh, you work at a hotel. Makes sense. That makes sense. Gotcha. Got you. Oh my god. Chef, thank you so much for the tier one sub for seven months, Chef. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Whenever I play this, I always just save up for the F20 e free. Oh yeah, I, that's what I do. I, I don't spend... I play the entire game with the first plane until I can save up for the million dollar plane. No, 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 I paused it. I paused it. I paused it. But yeah, I I always play the game with um Oh, we got an extra life. Until I can get the um the last plane. That's my strat. We can make it to the end. <coughs> There's a full heal. I just need to get to the shield. Damn. There was the shield. I have Ikaruga. Ronald, I have Ikaruga. Oh crap. Okay. You can also cycle through extra weapons. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I know. I know everything about this game, Texie. I know everything. I've beaten this game on every mode possible. This is one of my favorite games. It is really convenient that you can change weapons um, in the pause screen. A little tough, but you'd be willing to try again. Oh, yeah. See, the good thing about this game is that uh, there's no RNG. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah. I've... This is my... This is my cartridge that I've had since I was a kid. So, it's like... It's definitely, like, one of my favorites. I really love it. Hi, Shadowcast. Hello, welcome in. How are you? It's a cart that can never leave, exactly. I lost a lot of crap.
Back in 2000, Metallica sued Napster. Yep, I remember that. They tightened copyright infringement. Yeah, 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 I saw that. I saw that lost my mind about the con the concert that Twitch had to put uh, generic music over. I saw that. Straw Bunny, thank you so much for the tier ones, the prime sub for four months. Thank you, Straw Bunny. How are you? Hi, Jack Boy. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Generic stock music. Yeah, I saw it was all over Twitter. It was super funny. Straw Bunny, how you doing today? Welcome in. I hope you're doing well. Thank you so much for coming by and saying hello. I really appreciate it. I'm doing very well, thank you. How is your weekend going? You love my chair? Thank you. My my super awesome Kirby blanket. I love so much. How have you been? What you been playing lately, Bunny? Demon Castle. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love Super Castlevania 4. Hi, Core! Hello, Core. It's good to see you. You're playing Blue Fire. It's a game that came out this month. You're this into collecting. I need to see your amiibo. Oh, man. All right. I have amiibo across enti the entire wall of the room. I have every single Smash Amiibo. So there is Amiibo across the entire room. I am very well, Core. How was your weekend going? It's nice to see you. I hope everything is good. Got a lot of stuff. That's so cool. Oh man, thank you, Smash Amiibo. I got a lot of fun stuff. Thank you. The lifetime of collecting. We're just playing. I I hooked up my Super Nintendo to the OSSC core, and now we're playing UN Squadron on hard mode. We were playing the Amiga earlier. You have Amiibo Animal Crossing cards? I have some. I do have some. Yes, I do have some. The real SNES. Yup. Yup. Right there, there it is. It's by. M Hold on, there you go. There it is, right there. I should put it behind me. I should see if I can put it behind me. Put it right here so people could see it. Oh man. The 90s SNES, heck yeah. The mic is blocking it, yeah. I need a, I need a, um, I need a new mic arm. Cause this mic arm, I'm not really a huge fan of. But it works, you know? Here we go. Yeah. Thank you, Mantle. But how you been, Core? I hope work is going well. I hope you're doing well. Sorry for the auto mod. Oh yeah, nah, that's cool. Auto auto mod is set to super high right now, just because of you know certain things going on. It's just trolls. Nah, 
they're just trolling. The best thing is to just not take the bait. Never feed the trolls, you know? Because that's what they want, is that reaction. That doesn't matter. Yeah. It, it really... Because once you show that, like... Thank you for the lurk, Straw Bunny. Once you show that... You know... It affects you, then... They'll come back, but... Please. Alright, here we go. Exactly. Thank you. Exactly, Mantle. There you go. Well, let me make sure that it didn't... Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright. Alright. Here we go. I need- I'm I'm trying to warm up here. I'm trying to warm up. But, like, my brain is not, like, cooperating. My brain is not cooperating here. Also, I need to change the... Hi, Inu Smasha. Hello, welcome in. How are you? The frame rate is set to 60, so that's why we're getting some frame skips. We're getting some frame skips here. I'm also gonna try and do this. I'm gonna try and 1cc this. That's why I restarted the game. Hi, Craig. How are you today? Welcome in. It's good to see you. I hope you're doing well. Thank you so much for coming by and saying hello. I think next time we broadcast, we'll do Mario Paint. Yeah, this is hard mode. Yep. I could do gamer mode, but my other controller was not working for some weird reason, so... Um... I couldn't select it, because you need a controller in port 2 to be able to select gamer mode. Although I could probably put the controller that doesn't work in port 1, and then just select it with port 2 and swap over. I feel like I just have the best day. Kermit! Hi, Kermit! How are you today? It's good to have you. I hope you're doing well. Mario Paint is love. I'm so excited. I really would love to play Mario Paint with you all. Want to stop by and say what's up? You coolin'? Glad I'm alright? I'm glad. Um, yeah, I'm glad you could stop by and say hello. I really appreciate that. Yeah, everything is good, you know? We're just hanging in there. You be Persona 5? That's awesome! I've never played a Persona game. I'm so glad that you had a good day. Do I want to know what gamer mode is? Gamer mode, Ronald, is the hardest mode. It's harder than hard. So it's, it's like the most difficult mode of the game. It's really difficult. But the good thing about this game is there's no RNG, so you can memorize everything. You can memorize everything. It's your first persona? Nice! You left a YouTube clip of the introduction of the first stage of the Amiga game Turkin! With the legendary music? Where did you leave it? You left me a clip where? Oh, in my Discord. Thank you. Thank you for doing that. That's awesome. I can't wait to check it out. Can't wait to check it out. That's awesome. Yeah, Core, we were playing all sorts of Amiga games earlier. It was really fun. Some of them worked. Some of them didn't. But it was... It was a wild ride. It was a wild ride. Oh, I'm I'm glad to have a space for you in you smasha. I'm sorry that you had a rough day. Spent last year playing through most of the Dragon Quest. Oh nice! Dragon Quest is so great. I'm convinced McCoy is the mastermind behind this war in the game. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I've never played a Persona game, but I, I really want to play through some Dragon Quest games. That's really cool. Amiga Ash, yeah. It was really fun. I'm so glad that we were able to do, do that. Got an extra life. Damn. 
Just not focused. I'm not focused. At least we got an extra life. Were my favorites SNES ones are super two. Yeah, I really love um Dragon Quest um the slime game. Oh man, it's so fun. I played that on DS a lot. Sorry if I'm quiet, everyone. I just feel focused. Focus mode is important. No, you know, I, uh... You know how much I don't... I like, uh, making sure that chat feels welcome. Laser focused. Yeah, man, I'm trying to... See if I can 1cc this. That'll be super neat. I also don't want two of these planes on the screen at the same time, because that's really bad. The chat bounce with focus and turn. Confuse I'm sorry is perfect. I have fun just watching the plane go pew pew pew! Alright, here we go. So when you get up to this part, don't waste any of your ammo until it stops. And then you'll start taking damage. I learned that from Talos. I learned that from- Ah! Sorry for shouting. Alright. Here we go. This is definitely a game where it will probably be like sometimes I want to do like no cam streams because then I can really focus on the game. Been up since 5.30. Okay, Core, enjoy your lurk. Thank you, Inu Smasha. Thank you so much for the 100 bits. Dia, you love this game? Me too. It's one of my favorites. It's one of my favorite games of all time. How are you? Welcome in. I hope you're doing well. Thank you for coming by and saying hello. Oh, I totally ran into that. I totally ran into it. What's the game title? Oh, this is a uh, UN Squadron. This is a uh, UN Squadron on the Super Nintendo. Getting too sleepy. Oh man, Dino from the Yee thing. Oh, Toddy, go go to bed if you're tired. I don't want you to stay up too late. Hi, Saka. E. Toddy, I don't want to keep you up too late. I feel bad. Hi, Saka. It's good to see you. I hope you're doing well. Oh my gosh, I got hit twice. Alright, the boss is coming up. Okay, here we go. Staying up to watch cartoons on Nick Rewind. Awesome. Hi, Squaff. It was just going to slowly creep up on you. I know, right? I hope you're doing well, Squaff. Thank you so much for coming by and saying hello. 
All right, this is the level I wanted. All right. Doo, doo, doo. I love the music in this game. It's so freaking good. Da -da. Da -da -da. 80s anime characters yeah yeah this game um has an anime associated with it which is really good oh ronald thank you so much for hanging out i really appreciate it thank you so much take care and we'll see you next time thanks for hanging out i really appreciate it i don't keep dying i usually Hi, Sean. How are you? Welcome in. Thank you for coming by and saying hello. I appreciate it. Crap. Are you serious? Oh, God. Cyborg 9000 with Midway. The game was released in Japan as Area 88. Yep. Hi, hi, Noel. When I was a kid, I always wanted to have long enough hair to cover one eye like an anime character. Yo, same. Same. I should have did the other plane. Oh, well. Do, 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 do. Are you kidding? Everyone knows you should pick the grumpy burly dude. Oh, Greg Gates. I know, right? My family's pretty conservative, so I only have long hair after high school, and by that time, I didn't like anime anymore. Hi. <laughs> I hate the submarine so much. The submarine is the worst. Oh my god. Dun, dun. Do, 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 do. Oops. Oh, Squaw! Yo, Shook, thank you for gifting a tier once up to Squaw. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. All right, UN Squadron is is frustrating me. I need practice. Yee! Let's see what other games we have that we can play. I really love UN Squadron, but it's it's making me want to. It's making me want to rage. It's making me want to rage. A stack of games. Here we go. Oh man, lots of good games in that that stack. You might have to buy another. Exactly. My room is like a museum. There's so many games. You ever played Godzilla? I have not. I have not. Another arcade shooter, but very silly.
Here we go. Here we go. All right, so we've got Arcana. Hold on. Hey. Do we have Super R-Type? I don't think so. Hold on. I don't think so. Wait. Oh, here we go. I don't think so. Watch someone played it the other week. Mothra is your usual flying shooter. Character or Godzilla is stuck to the ground. What? That is so... That's crazy. Okay, here we go. We've got Arcana. Which is like an RPG. A dungeon crawler style RPG. Um. Oh my god. I have to go be right back. Bobby is Bobby is acting crazy right now. Bobby is acting crazy right now. She will not stop. I'll be right back. good this game is but i never played master mode so i'm like okay let's try it it can't be that hard oh shit oh man okay all right i'm back i'm back she was she was like acting nuts she wouldn't stop meowing. She wouldn't stop meowing, y'all. It was nutty. She was, yes, the zoomies. Yeah. All right. Yeah, she was just being crazy. All right, we have Eye of the Beholder, which y'all know is one of my favorite games of all time. I love this game so much. Super Mario RPG. RPG. We could do actually let's do this one. Let's do this one. I won't show y'all what it is. Let's do this one. I won't show you what it is. Think you caught the title? Surprise. It's about to be the same way. Your cat woke up. Oh, it's bugging out. Let's see if this works. What is with the game not working today? There we go. Here we go. Super cozy time now. Oh, what the French toast? How was it doing that? Okay, there we go. Hi, Kasenka. Hello. How are you? Welcome in. How's it going? I hope you're having a good day today. Man, this looks so good. Oh, we already have files on here. Shug, thank you for gifting a tier one sub to Sean. Let's start a new file, though. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Here we go. You can't hear the game audio? Okay. Turn it up. Audio's good? I'll turn it up. OSCC is working! Yup! Good, good. Thought I'd see what you were up to. Yeah, we're playing some Super Nintendo games on the OSSC. 
You like Yoshi's Island? It looks really good. It looks really, really awesome. Well, thank you so much for coming by, Kasinka. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much for sharing your time with us. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thanks. This game is Liddy. Yo, chill. What's up? How are you? Did they remaster it? Yeah, it did go on the GBA. That is true. Slurp sound. But not the same. Other games are similar. Yeah, there's Yoshi's Story. And there's Yoshi's Woolly World. Yo. Was there a secret down here? I don't think so. Because there's secrets all over this game. That was the one thing that was fun. All the secrets. But I never beat it. It's tough. There are some parts of this game that's really difficult. I remember seeing it just didn't look like this fluffy. Yoshi's Crafted World is also a lot of fun. Yes! Hater Tot, how are you? Welcome in. Thank you so much for coming by. I really appreciate it. My favorite Yoshi, Jen. Yes. 10 out of 10 OST. Chilling before you go to bed. I hear that. Always loved Yoshi, me too. I love Yoshi. Yoshi is the cutest. This game is so cozy, you know? We're definitely gonna... I think this will be a really good one to continue to play. Oops. Hey! He went away! Shoot, I missed him. Dang, yo. Not, I don't think we're gonna be able to 100% the level. I need to get good. Look at these little shy guys. They're so cute. Touch fuzzy, get dizzy. Playing Smash Brawl? Heck yeah. Touch fuzzy, get dizzy. It's true. And here we go. Oh, we could get more eggs here. Are you like how egg throwing worked in Crafted World? Yeah. I don't think I... I think I have Crafted World, but I didn't beat it. Nintendo will port the DS remake? Yeah. You could always tell which were the red coins, because they had like a slightly red tint. Get that one up. Let's go. Oh, Droxy, thank you so much for saying hello. I appreciate it. You can continue to lurk if you feel more comfortable. We always appreciate the lurk, you know? Always appreciate it. Dang. Are you serious? <laughs> Oh my gosh, everyone. This is terrible. There we go. Finally. Another game? Hi, Jay Cyan! Thank you so much. Take care. Thank you so much for coming by, Jay. I appreciate that. Alright. Jesus. Don't. 
get some of these red coins. Oh, wait, I think we... No, 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 we didn't get all of them. There we go. Maybe that's another game. I think the red coins spin the opposite way too. Do they? Do they? Let's take a look. Maybe we can get that, um... That little shy guy we missed before. See if we can get it. Because I'm sad that we missed that. Back? Nope. Oh, missed it. That's bogus town. We missed it. Are you serious? Hi, Ed! Hello! How are you? You had a busy week? I know, it's been so busy. I hope you had a great day today, Ed. It's so good to see you. Thank you for coming by and saying hello. Okay. Okay. I think we ran out of eggs. Today has been really good. Oh man, I'm so glad to hear that. Yeah, everything has been good for me too, you know? We're just, we're just chilling. We're just having a very cozy, relaxing day. We were testing out Amiga all day and it was really fun. You know? So, I had a really awesome day. Touch fuzzy. Touch fuzzy and get dizzy. Do, 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 do. What? Oh man. I did not expect that to happen. Sorry for zoning out, y'all. I'm just like getting stuck into the game. Get dizzy. I think we got all five of them. Nice. We definitely lost some stars because we got eaten by that piranha plant. Just bogus town. Hi, Blue! Blue! How are you? I hope you're doing well. Thank you for coming by and saying hello. Hi, Party God Kevin. Hello. Welcome in. It's great to see you. I hope you're having a good day. Do we 100%? Oh, we 100% this level. Yay. What's good? I'm doing well. I'm doing great. Um, Kevin and Blue, I'm doing really great. Oh, we get a bonus challenge. We 100% it though. <laughs> Yay, bonus pog. Let's freaking go, y'all. Awesome. Go. Pink Yoshi. Okay, let's see what mini game we got. Scratch and match. Here we freaking go. Scratch and freaking match. When I become a partner in November. In November of 2020. In November. Scratch three boxes, uncover Mario's to gain one up. Scratch one. One Mario makes one one up. Two Mario's, two ones up. Two one ups. And three Mario's, five ups. Woo. All right. Got one Mario. All right, all right, all right. Let's see, let's do here. No, not a Kamek! We don't want that. Three Marios, let's go, I wish. Let's do right here. Another stinking Kamek! Doggone it. Well, we got one one up. Can't sneeze, at least we got one and not zero. Yo, he just yeeted Mario. Did y'all see that? He just freaking yeeted Mario. 
What the French toast? So close yet so far. Seriously. Man, this is the ones with the the big chomp things. Uh oh. No! I died. I guess that's Red Yoshi, not pink. Try this stage again. F. It looks pink to me. It looks pink to me. Oh, we lost all our eggs. Darn. Yo, thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Woof! Uh... You almost got us. Yo, get out of here, fool! What the heck? Everything scared me as a kid. This level scared me as a kid. I don't blame you. Bruh, this look- this game is tough! This game is deceptively hard. It's always like the cute ones too, you know? It's always the cute games that get you. <gasps> oh, come back! No, no, no. I wanna butt stomp this. I don't know if there's a secret in here. What the French Toast needs to be a shirt? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Die hard. I'm working on it. We continue from here. All right, let's go. You remember? Press Y and down to make an egg. Press A to throw an egg. Oh yes, I remember. Thanks for the reminder, though. Hey, we needed that. Ooh, ooh, we got some stars there. That was good. You're so distracted by the cuteness. Exactly. You really are. You're distracted by the cuteness and you're like, okay, this game is gonna be a, a easy game. It has a baby in it, so it must be a baby's game. Little shy guy, I know. Like, it must be a little baby's game, but it's not. It's tough. The lies, exactly. There's nothing cute about a screaming bubbly, bubble baby Mario. Seriously. Difficult to master, much less complete. Exactly. Right. Oh, so many levels of cute. It's true. I need all the coins, everyone. I need to get all the coins. Is there something down here? I love this music too, it's so good. Baby Mario constantly crying, so we're really- Oh yes, that is like the biggest pain point of this game. Is the crying baby Mario. I know. It's really- it's really, really, really annoying. So many eggs. This isn't Doom on subs. Hi, Ron. How are you? How do the eggs walk? I don't know. They're very bouncy. They're very bouncy, these eggs. I love that- I love that they turn into different stuff in this game, too. Like, there's so many different things you can turn into. You're a helicopter, what? Super Mario World 2 Yoshi's Island, but the next game is called Yoshi's Island 2, go figure. This game is wild. Oh man, it's so much fun. Yo, hi Epic, how are you? Welcome in. Bouncy eggs make for tasty rubber omelets. Just got finished eating dinner not too long ago. How am I doing? I'm doing very well. Yeah, I'm having such a great day. I'm glad that I'm able to share this. 
How are you doing, Epic? I hope you're having a good day. Thank you for coming by and saying hello. We were working on Amiga stuff earlier. It was really fun. Do you want one crime, baby? True. Exactly. Servius, you love the bosses? I'm good. Tuning in from work. Nice. That's great. Well, I hope work isn't too busy. I'm glad to hear you're doing well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're having such a great day. I had a lot of fun playing all the Amiga stuff with everybody. And going through that and seeing what worked. And what didn't work. Even though it was kind of driving me crazy some things, you know? I like that. That sound sounds like a fart to me every single time. It always makes me laugh, you know? Where am I working? Wait. It's 12 a.m. Saturday night. It's 12 a.m. Yeah, yeah, like Saturday night into Sunday morning. I'm not, I'm not working. Epic Android is working. Where? Wait, there's something here and I need it. Reminds me of balloons deflating and flying around. Yup. There was something up there. Did y'all see it? There was something up there. Probably got something like, yes, yes, very funny. Very funny. I like that little squeak he makes when he gets hit. It's super cute. Okay. Right here. See? Okay. Oh, man. Alright, let's see. We can make it all the way over. Okay, I know that we need to get to that, but I just want to make sure that I don't miss anything up here. I think we're good. This little chopper that could. Hi, Leech! How are you? Welcome in! I hope you're having a good day. We're playing the Super Nintendo from the OSSC today. Made a ROM hack where this is just a little chopper? Oh my gosh, probably. Oh, we missed the one up. Damn. You're carding and lurking? Oh, awesome! That sounds like a lot of fun. Did we? Oh, we did 100% this level. So great. We 100%ed this level, everyone. All right. Let's hope we get a bonus round. I hope we get a bonus round. Yay, we did! Woo! Do, do, do. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate you. Oh, thank you, Mantle. Are you are you cracked on Mario Kart? I have Mario Kart. Lurking Kart, South Florida's premier lurking karting extravaganza. <laughs> I'm not that good at Mario Kart. I really stink at Mario Kart, but I like to play. All right, another scratching match. Come on. I hope I was hoping we would get a different bonus game. All right. All right, we got one baby Mario. We got one little baby Mario. Let's try this one. No, not a Kamek! Frickin' A. Not another Kamek. Try this one. Two baby Marios! Yay! All right, we got two baby Marios. That was better than before. More like ka heck. This is not touch fuzzy get dizzy, right? Is it? It could be touch fuzzy get dizzy. Oh no, it's not. Cave of Chomp Rock. Ooh, what's this? The one up. 
The prize parent group didn't say anything about this part of the game. Teaching kids to play lottery scratchers. They probably did. They probably did, you know? I wouldn't be surprised, honestly. Whee! Wait, did we need this rock for something? Hoping for the education lotteries. Oh man. I miss gambling in Nintendo. <laughs> Do I have one of those arcade one-ups in my place? I don't. I don't. I would love to get one one day, but I think they're like three, four hundred dollars. You know? Maybe one day. They should make a new Excite bike. That would be so cool. I agree, Liege. I agree. Alright, let's get some eggs. All right, cool. The game is so chill. You love the Excite Bike? Excite Bike is so awesome. It's really fun. Make it like that ATV game, but pure with the Mario Kart engine. Oh, heck yeah. That sounds like it would be so fun. Heck yeah! Yeah, here we go. I'd be interested to see a new take on it. Me too. There was an Excite Truck on the Wii? Yes, yes, I had Excite Truck. It is not the same, but yes, at least they did like keep the name alive somehow, some way. You know? But yes, I remember Excite Truck. Yeah, they're really expensive, but it's worth it. You own the Mortal Kombat and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle one? That is so neat, Ron. Excitra was really fun. Yeah, especially with the Wii remote controls, right? I forgot about it. Me too. Sometimes those titles get slept on. Arcade one-up cabinets. Do they use Sanwa controls? What's a Sanwa control? What is that? I'm not sure what it is. The most sought after? Oh, is it a type of button? A type of control for the arcade? That would be super neat. The brand of arcade stick. Oh, got you. Got you. That key, everyone. Got it. Very durable and well made. That's awesome. I'm not sure. I'd love to learn more about it. Excite bike, excite truck, and what I'm wondering is when do they plan on making an excite car, though? Exactly. Throwing balloons. Okay, here we go. To throw the balloon key in the button sequence as shown, the game time is limited. If the balloon pops on you, then you lose. Collect an item if you win. Excite boat. Excite scooter. Excite car. Need for speed. Alright. Oops. You sound what joysticks is button, unfortunately. I thought it was cruising USA. Oh man. It popped on him. Ha ha ha. Excite unicycle. I didn't even realize we we're using a blue Yoshi. This Yoshi, this Yoshi is super cute. Did they take? Oh no, I used all my eggs. I was like, where did all my eggs go? I'm trying not to get hit because we have a hundred. Yeah, we have perfect stars. So we need to find two more flowers and three more coins. Excite Ash, correct, Church Shy Guy. I like to. I like to smash these down because sometimes, it, yeah, you see, there was a red coin back there. 
Sometimes there's secrets underneath these things, everyone. You have to do- you have to search everywhere, because this game is very trolly with hiding things, you know? The game is very trolly. Okay, here we go. That sound. Hey, get away from me, you. You're trying to get me. You're trying to get me. Push this over. Can we go down in here? Oh, we can. What's in here? Oh, this is a throwback to Super Mario 2. They definitely would cost way more than two to three hundred bucks if they use Sanwa joystick and buttons. It probably costs like six to eight hundred. I see. Yeah, if they're using premium parts like that, that makes sense. A Mario 2 pipe. Yes, isn't that so cool? It's a throwback. No? See, look, there was a secret in there. We found a secret. That. Okay, so let's see if there's a secret in here. Thanks for hanging me, hanging out with me, everyone. Y'all are so awesome. Oh, excuse me. Yoshi, Yoshi, panic. Oh, look at all these coins. Got a one up. Woohoo! Oh man. We we got a lot of coins. That was awesome. Whee! Found a secret. Found a secret. I don't want to squish this shy guy. There we go. I need, I wanted it to turn him into an egg. No no no, come back! I need to get up there. Oh please don't! Fiddlesticks. It would be awesome if there's a new Excite Bike for the Switch. Hi, Crypto. How are you today? Have you ever speed ran a game? Nope. I never have, but I would like to learn. I would love to learn. I would probably speed run UN Squadron or Batman for the NES. I don't know. I feel like. I feel like it would be difficult at first for me to learn because I would I would feel like I would need to do it perfectly but I would totally be into learning did we 100% this level we sure did we sure did everybody see he tried to get me he tried to get me and make me lose some stars and then I wouldn't have 100% of the level Oh man, he tried to get me here too! Gotcha. God, we got an extra life too. The rod of the game if you plan on speedrunning. True, true. Alright, let's hope we get- Let's hope we get an extra- Let's see if we get a bonus round. Yay, bonus round time! Mega Man 2 would be a good speedrun. Yeah, that would probably be a great one. Three in a row! We did it! Cheese the stages. Yup, yup, yup. Do do. Perfecto. Another scratch and match. Frick, man. All right. All right, baby Mario. Come back. Blasted come back. We love playing the lottery. Can you do you on Squadron Deathless? Probably on like easy or medium. Yes. But on hard or gamer, not yet. Such a completionist. Alright. How do I save? Does the game auto save? It auto saves. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to call it here, everybody, because we've been on for five hours. We've been on for five hours. Oh god, you know I was trying to type. It's been an amazing time. We got through so many Amiga games. Yo, we did a lot today. I'll be on tomorrow 
I'll be on tomorrow for Sega Sunday. I'll be on tomorrow for Sega Sunday. I hope you all had fun. I had a blast. No, it's okay, Leech. We'll be back tomorrow with some more Golden Axe Warriors. Yo, night night at and he, you know, thank you so much for hanging out. Here's my Twitter and Instagram. Follow me there for updates. We'll definitely play more Super Nintendo with the OSSC because it looks awesome. And here's the Discord. If anybody wants to jump in the Discord um to hang out, I would appreciate that. Thank you. This was fun. Thank you, Analog Boy. I appreciate you for hanging out. I think you can use the mask system with the OSSC. Yeah, my... <coughs> Sorry. My master system's not working right now. I have to fix it. I have to fix it. I have to take it in to get fixed in. Phantom Souls of the Laundry Mat I played in. Oh, it's... Yes, I love Golden Axe, but we're playing Golden Axe Warrior, which is an RPG game based in the world of Golden Axe. But yes, I love Golden Axe. Droxy, take care. Any Shinobi? Yeah, we did actually play Shinobi one time. We did, but I will definitely do it again. I will definitely do it again. So let's find a nice person to raid everyone is everyone okay with hanging out for a raid? Is everyone okay with hanging out for a raid? Because I would really appreciate if we could hang out for a raid. That would be super duper duper awesome. Seriously. I would really, really love to share some joy with somebody. Have you all share some joy with somebody? You know? So I think it would be super neat if we could give some joy. So let's go hang out with somebody. There's so many great people on. Let's find a nice person. There's so many great people on. I'm just making sure, like, I like to go through and make sure we can find somebody that's not ending their broadcast. So that's why I like to check first. I like to check first because that would stink if we go to hang out with somebody and then they're like, oh, by the way, we're about to be done. You know? Da -da -da. All right, let's go hang out with this person. They're playing UN Squadron. All oh, thanks for the dope games. Joy is good, yes. Thanks so much, Die Hard. Thank you, Mantle. Thank you, Manny. Thank you, everyone. Yeah, let's go hang out with this person. They're playing you on Squadron, and they're super awesome. It's very chill and laid back. It's very chill and laid back. So let's go cheer them on as they beat you on Squadron. They're trying to do a 1cc run. Take care, Leech. Thank you so much for coming by. They're trying to do a 1cc run on gamer mode so let's go cheer them on because i think i think that that would be awesome you know let's give them all the joy and all the love and i'll see you all tomorrow um probably somewhere between 12 and 3 somewhere in 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 there i'm not sure um but yeah thank you so much everyone don't forget to tell your friends ash said hi i really 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 appreciate you all for spending the day with me and uh helping me test out my amiga and um let's go let's go all right take care everybody bye 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 everyone bye <laughs>